government provided everything you need? Of course, of course. And I'm so grateful for all of it. I just want to give my recipes a little extra. Are these ingredients approved? Please, they should be arriving any second. As soon as they do, I'll fix you something and you can see what all the fuss is about. You're gonna love it, I promise. See, here's my assistant now. Ugh. Did you bring the stuff? Those three things I asked you for? Uh... Oh, of course. Those three things. Wait, this troublemaker is your assistant? She's no trouble. And she's got a good eye for ingredients. Right? That's, uh... That's right. Well, we don't want to keep our guests waiting, do we? Uh, something flowery, something dirty, and something sweet. I'm on it. Ah, my very punctual assistant. Did you get everything? Uh, not yet. Oh, no rush. What am I supposed to get again? We've been over this. Something flowery, something dirty, and something sweet. Ah, got it. <laughs> You're so forgetful. Can't all be knower types, am I right, officers? Still down here, I see. Hmm. Look at your colors. Still miscellaneous, too. Never thought miscellaneous keep things together. Please. No, I didn't think so. When are you gonna shape up and earn some shades? Dangerous to break your anonymity. You don't know anything. I could guess. I don't have all day. Go and do your miscellaneous things. Hey, whose flowers are these? Not ours, and they're not even real. Don't touch them unless you want a bloody nose. Damn. Why don't you ask Coco? I don't want to be judged. Tough break. Keep an eye out for me. I'll keep two. Looks like trouble. Wait for it to pass. I don't have that luxury. Then you better move quickly. Will do. Do you have something sweet? Do you? Never mind. Never mind, never mind, never mind. Okay. What's in the boxes? Wouldn't you like to know? Something flowery? In a sealed box? Flowers need daylight, dummy. Not that we get much down here. Something sweet? Why, you got a sweet tooth? Maybe. Something dirty? Wow, just straight up asking, hey? Acting like a red, but you're way too green. Everything in here is squeaky clean, I promise. Officer? <laughs> I'm not. Well, tell me, hmm? I only deliver to people on my list. And you're not on my list. If you want to get on it, go talk to the folks on... The rooftops. I know. Oh. Wait. Aren't you the miscellaneous who... I'll be on my way. See you around. Sure. Oh, little one. Late as always. Do you have to call me that? You mustn't fear the truth. Embrace it. Only then can you take part in the grand ecosystem. Right. You see, this plant and old town are one and the same. Oh, yeah? They will both wilt without you. So do please take extra care. I won't forget next time. Good. Now, what can I do for you? Are you still dreaming of the upstairs? I've just never seen it before. Is it so bad to be curious? 
Such expectations are never fulfilled. But you know, there is a sky. Really? A sky? That is all I will say. Maybe one day you'll see with your own eyes. Miscellaneous don't get to go up there. That's not entirely true. I don't have the talent she does. All those wild mixtures. Then you'll just have to find out what you're good at. You mean something legal? Unfortunately, yes. <laughs> I'm sorry I forgot to water the plants. Don't apologize to me. I'm not the one dying of thirst. Stop. <laughs> you know, up there, I'm the sensitive one. So rub it in. When will you learn to wake up on time? Sometimes I don't want to wake up. I don't want to forget. You should keep those thoughts to yourself. I know. <laughs> this place is really coming together. We should have greenery down here too. So, there's plants upstairs? I've said too much. Come on. My lips are sealed. Ugh. <laughs> Bartender needs something flowery. Up to her old games, I see. Here's something that will surprise even her. Chrysanthemum. Oh, thank you. I hope she stays out of trouble. Me too. <laughs> I gotta go. Wait, why do you want to go upstairs so badly? Bartender. She says miscellaneous for the future. And uh, I have to believe she's right. What else is there? I see. Well, tread lightly, sister. I'll try. What do you think? Like it? You did this? It's my latest piece. With a little something to say within the lines, if you know what I mean. Can't paint if you get incinerated, you know? You're so talented. It's still stuck in miscellaneous. Hmm. It's okay. I make what I want to make. Not painting a red to save my life. Did you know her? Who? Her. No. Before my time. Only stories. Same. Everything is blurry about that time. Most sisters stay quiet if they're old enough. Even bartender doesn't talk about it much. Smart of her. Mm. You think I should do the high minister next? I wouldn't push your luck. <laughs> I'll think about it. Forty-eight. You all right? Bartender's in trouble. Sorry, I can't be at the front. From each according to her ability. To each according to her need. Thank you. If you need to beat a hasty retreat, come find me. I know the shadows. Will do. Sister! The ancient sister's sin courses through our veins. Forgive us, Mother. We did not deserve your love. We are dirty, filthy. Dirty, you say? Yes. We must incinerate for our sins. Only then will she rise again. Only then will she come back to us. So, you're asking to be incinerated? They will not grant us our wish. They say every sister is precious. I say, we cannot live with such burdens. You want to stop living? No. But nothing is gained without sacrifice. You're saying she'll come back? Is it not a possibility? I heard they incinerated her in front of everyone. Though her body is gone, it is statistically possible she will come again. As one of us. One of us? We know the birthing process is chaotic, but if we roll the dice enough times, she may appear again. We offer our bodies to be burnt, so a new sister can be birthed. And the process can be accelerated. 
What else are we miscellaneous good for? Is that statue the original? Our predecessors acted quickly so that we can be gifted. It is our link to her. It is the original, sister. Behold, with her eyes. You said you were dirty. Only fire can cleanse us. Hmm. Give me a strand of your hair. I do not deserve such reference. I will burn it for you. Would that make you happy? Sister, I am touched. You would help me so? Rid this world of a piece of me? It's the least I can do. Here. Burn it in secret. Our red sisters, they do not see the shame we all carry. I'll leave you to it. Sister, seek redemption. It is the only way. I see it on your face. You have hurt others before, intentionally or by accident. It does not matter. Burn with us and be saved. Long. Nothing to see here. There is clearly something to see here. All sisters are free to worship as they choose. But you fence them off? It's for their own protection and yours. I'm sure it is. I suggest you plug your ears. Don't listen to this death cult. Be a free thinking sister. I'll keep that in mind. Keep your distance. They may begin self-immolating. Is everything okay? I've got to bring back supplies. Another one of her concoctions? They keep getting stranger. What did she ask for this time? So, you chose a name. Is this really the time? Do you like it? I do. I thought about it for so long. Melody, like a song, you know? It suits you. Hey, when are you gonna choose a name? Why you gotta be so old school? Ah, gotta go. Hey, wait, go. She said go. Something sweet? Hmm. Maybe something from... What did I say about burning bridges? We'll find a way up to the rooftops. But I better hurry. I'll keep watch and ring the alarm if anything goes down. Don't escalate. I heard you the first time. Vicky, what are you doing downstairs? Old Town is my home. You'll get it one day. You'll have to go around. You listen to them all day? Oh, I've heard everything. Burn me, burn me. <laughs> You're gonna live a long, good life. I guarantee it. I'll watch them day in, day out. No harm will come to any of them. <laughs> Why not give them what they want? They're sick. Prime Minister wants to see them cured. It's a compassionate thing to do. You don't really believe we'd incinerate them, do you? The provisional government serves all sisters, especially the ones who need help. Hey, 48, what's going on over there? It's bartender. The Reds are harassing her. You want backup? Gather the others. All. You got it. Hey, 48. Yeah? You're one of us. Time to pick a real name.
Look at you. I knew you would come crawling back. I need something sweet. It's important. Does it look like I care? She doesn't want to see your face. Fine. I thought we all had the same face. You know what I mean. Let me up. It's not going to be that easy. <laughs> what do you want? A simple drop-off. Point A to point B. I don't need any more trouble. You do something for me, I do something for you. That's how it works. So? <sighs> Where do I go? Not far. Other side of town, sitting on a park bench by the picture of you-know-who. <sighs> Here's the goods. Hmm? Off you go. Don't even think about it. About what? Whatever it is you're thinking about. Stop. Don't think about it. Don't think. No. No, no, no. Don't do it. Good. Be gone. Your biometrics get updated? Mm-mm. I didn't think so. You don't have to be so mean about it. And you don't have to try to repeatedly sneak past me. Last time was a bit fun, wasn't it? I'm not answering that. Do you ever get tired standing here all day? My fatigue is irrelevant. We're all building a new way, bit by bit. Maybe you'll decide to be a part of it someday. Hey. Grow some colors. Bartender goes up. She's been grandmothered in. You? Do something of actual value. Like you? Like me, asshole. You're not bored? We all have to play our part. Nothing gets done alone. Not even some music? Art is a distraction. And frivolous. Even tomorrow's play? That is a rare occasion. Only the finest for you. How can I be bored with you around? I'm touched. Want an injection after hours? Nice try. There's no way I'm breaking anonymity around you. We could be flatmates and I wouldn't even know it. That's correct. And your armed friends. They don't know who you are either? Or we're friends. And then we're not. It's better this way. You trust them? With my life. Romantic. That's enough from you. Keep up the good work. You may not know who I am, but I know who you are. Kind of unfair, isn't it? That's why you should watch what you say. Message received. Did I hear something? Sounded like an invisible person trying to get my attention. No, must be nothing. Did you get funny recently? Got it, got it. Hey, I know you, don't I? You've got a line on some sweet solids. I work in fluids now. No, no, you, you delivered to me before. Ran it to me straight from the rooftops. Jackie, wasn't it? We've got the wrong person. Well, um, send her my way if you see her. She's the best. So, have you decided to burn? I'll leave you to it. Sister, seek redemption. It is the only way.
You should be careful. Hey, you're not my mom. Our mom. I mean, Pira. I've never done anything like this before. Hey, I'm not judging. It's just so... Let me guess. You've been around the block? Upstairs, downstairs, the other side? Took you long enough. What did you say? What? Are you okay? I'm fine. Just a little deja vu. I swear it's just to deal with the changes. Before my time. All of it. Lucky you. Hey, listen. Just make sure you eat this around someone else, okay? For the, you know, mask part. Don't want to breathe the air by accident. Thank you. Here you go. I finally get to taste that cake. What was it like before? Before? Oh. Did you know her? Who? You know who. Ah. I did. What was she like? Oh. Uh... Exactly as they say, yeah? <laughs> Let's talk about something else. Good idea. You said something about a cake? When did I say that out loud? Something, something, finally get to taste? Mm, we used to look at cake. Okay. Look, but not touch. Look, but not taste. Gotcha. Did you know the All Mother? Oh. Not personally. I wonder what she was like. She was... Uh, great. Yes, great. You must be pretty old then. Uh, sorry, I didn't mean it like that. My boss is old, too. She's bartender. You know her? Inside Sunrise. Yeah, that's a good one. Some old thing. Be careful. Thank you. Yeah, it's done. Good girl. Now will you let me up? I'm not like you. I don't break promises. 
Let's go. I couldn't believe it. She wants to see me. She wants something sweet. You, with your upstairs aspirations. How long will it take for you to understand they don't want you up there? You don't fit in. Do we have to go over this again? You should appreciate people that see you for who you are. You were the best cook I ever had. Why don't you make it yourself? I only work with fluids now. Sisters just want to taste, feel something in their stomach. It's our function to service them. Self-assigned function. You need to get with the times. Mother is dead. I'm sure we can help in some way. How? By cleaning their floors, wiping their shoes? Making them feel good for letting us in. Bartender says, please. That old hag likes to play it both ways. I say pick a floor and stick to it. Your imagination is wasted playing by the rules. I won't bother you again. Is that what you think I want? Here. Something bittersweet, a taste of cherry. Thank you. Whenever they let you up, if they ever do, just remember who first made a place for you and never ask for anything in return. Done? I'm done. Traitors first. I got what you asked for. Great, kid. Hold on a second. What is that stuff? How did you get it? Officer, I promise. There's nothing out of line here. Some trimmings. Drippings. Scrapings. Stuff that sisters would be throwing out to recycle back into the system. But... It's all still gonna end up in the same place, yeah? It's just making one more little stop along the way. In your arm, am I right? Come on, plug in. At least give it a try. <laughs> you see? This is what I mean. <sighs> Why don't you grab a seat and... How many times have I told you? We need to think of a sustainable future. We cannot afford your embellishments. We'll be confiscating this. Ugh. Hold on. Do you have an issue, Miss Linus? Speak up. Hecky Grace. Officers. Knock it off with that religious crap. Pardon me. Old habits. 
gratitude to the provisional government. You think just because you've got friends in high places, you'll be hearing from us. Ugh, I thought they were never going to leave. Maybe the new mix will get approved. Masterpiece. Why were you late, kid? You really screwed me. I must have slept in. Again? I'm really sorry. You're the one who told me you want to see the upstairs. Look, if you work hard enough, they'll see you as one of them eventually. But if you don't figure it out here, I don't know what's next for you. Nothing. That's what? Like every other miscellaneous here. We're trying to change that. Together. Every day. I don't want to wake up. In my dreams, I see sisters I've never seen before. Places I've never been. Why did I have to be born into this life? Hmm. We're all good at something, kid. <laughs> I can't aim. Sisters flinch at my touch. I break everything I try to fix. I can't even remember what ingredients you asked me for. I'm uh, <laughs> useless. In the eyes of the provisional government. What's the difference? I've seen you work. The solids you've made, you've got imagination, empathy. Not everyone can make something others find joy in. It was dangerous. And I just turned the other way. I'm worse than useless. <laughs> I'm a horrible sister. It's like those fanatics said. I should burn. Hey. Listen to me. No one is beyond forgiveness. Tell that to Jackie. Oh, wait. You can't. Are you going to let one moment define your life, no matter how bad? Or are you going to play the long game? I was so proud. I thought I had made something really special. I saw her cry out right in front of me. Look how far you've come. When I first found you, you were barely standing. Starved yourself or something. That mix you gave me. What was it called? Huh. An oldie but a goodie. Blue Communion. Saved my life. Yeah, well keep the name to yourself. You've always got so many secrets. Come on, kid. Go home. Rest up. Tomorrow's another day. I believe in you. I'll wake up on time. I promise. You better. this morning. <laughs> A simple job. And I still couldn't do it. It's hard to think these days. I don't mean to disappoint. 
it just happens again and again. I can't shake the feeling that nothing turned out right, you know? Like, you're not supposed to be a fucking flower. And I'm not supposed to be so... So... I don't know. I feel trapped. Like I need to go up for air. Tomorrow. Tomorrow, I'll remember. I promise, okay? I'll come by first thing in the morning and try to focus more on what's in front of me. I don't want her to be disappointed in me. I'm gonna do better. Thank you for being here and listening. I'll see you, Jax. And keep your chin up. One of us has to. Oh, shit. Right. The water. us alone. They're bullies. You don't have to tell me twice. Everything else okay? I'm... I'm good. I'm trying to get better. I know you get pulled back and forth a lot. By Chris, by bartender, they care about you. We all do. But have you ever stopped to ask what you want? Uh, I'm not... <laughs> um, <laughs> maybe a song? What? I want you to sing me a song. Uh, that's not what I meant. Come on. La 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 la. Something like this? <laughs> Excuse me. I was trying to be serious. La 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 la. <laughs> la 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 la. Okay. La 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 la. You're getting greedy. Hey, what are you doing? Get away from me! She would hurry. I'm doing my best, but some sisters aren't going to make it much longer. A real pain in my ass. Oh, I miss those days. But you didn't hear that from me. Got it? Hey. Out for an evening stroll. If you're thirsty, you'll have to wait until morning. Don't worry about it. I already got my fill. <laughs> I see. Isn't it dangerous to break anonymity like this, Uriah? It's sisters like you that are holding us back.
It's sisters like you I'm most worried for. You old bitch. We're the ones trying to make things better. Did you like it? My new mix? You and your kind remember too much for your own good. You just want to cling on to how things were. Maybe I'm a little sentimental. Did you ever think there's some things worth keeping? Or are you moving too fast to notice? Face it, you're just another dead end. <laughs> it really was my masterpiece. You want to know what I call it? I call it... Hello? Where is everyone? Hmm... I should check in at the bar. The bar? Melody? Melody, what's going on? Um... Where did everyone go? I'm... I'm sorry. What are you talking about? Miscellaneous. What do you think you're doing? You approach behind my back, unannounced. Hi, Minister. I'm waiting. I... I knew her. So did I. For longer than you've been alive. You must be her assistant. She talked about you all the time. What happened? It seems she shot herself. In the back. No. There's no way. Know your place, miscellaneous. There's no point arguing with the evidence. Wasn't she your friend, too? Such discrimination. We are all sisters. We all weep. How come I don't believe that? Not every sister mourns in the same way. I want you to remember that. Confirm, miscellaneous. I'm speaking to you. <laughs> High Minister, I confirm. Confirmation received. I'm updating your biometrics. As of now, you are granted upstairs privileges. Congratulations. Just like that. Be grateful. You serve a greater whole. On this solemn anniversary of Mother's death, we observe with a performance to remind ourselves of her last wishes. Sister, I think you are due for a reminder. And it goes without saying. Someone needs to tend bar.
to go up. Chris. I know. They killed her. They shot her in the back. Hey. They said she shot herself. I got you. You hear me? I got you. That old hag was one of us. They... They want me to go upstairs. One sister out, one sister in. It's sick. It's gonna be their mistake. Are you? I want you... I want you to help me hurt them. I need you to help me make them pay. This is what you want? Yes. You won't be coming back from this one. I don't care. <laughs> I could never say no to you, could I? Listen to me carefully. I will only say this once. Upstairs. There's a sympathizer. Meet her at the center of the orchard by the monument. She will get you what you need. But it will cost you. Do you understand? I do. And I'm not afraid. Hmm. I'll always be missing you, miscellaneous. I want you to call me Blue. I like that. I will be missing you. Blue. give you a hard time. Maybe I was just jealous. Forget it. I'll try to be better. Have a good life. Good luck up there. Thanks. Hey. Where are you going? Upstairs. What? They give you access? They want me to replace bartender. I know this look. What are you gonna do? Goodbye, Melody. Goodbye? I need to send them a message. That we're not disposable. But you'll throw your life away like this? I was already on borrowed time. I owe her this much. Do you think she would want this? And what about me? I want you to be safe. What did those fanatics say? Maybe I'll come around again. Make them pay. I will. Make it count. Send them one from Old Town. I'll be thinking of you. We're all with you. Thank you. Your biometrics get updated? Mm-hmm. They did. Really? You scan me or what? State your function. Bartender. Hmm. I'm sorry for your loss, sister. I have a function to perform. So you do. Gratitude to the provisional government. Gratitude to the provisional government.
train clearance? Uh, no clearance, no transit. Hey, you. Come over here. Don't make me ask twice, miscellaneous. Apologies for my hesitation. So you're a smart one, is that it? Not the smartest, but I can work. Oh, is that so? Most miscellaneous I know cut corners. Is that you? No, ma'am. Numbers? 48. Why do you think I stopped you? It's your duty. And what do you know about my duty? Hmm? Hmm? So, she knows when to be quiet. Hmm. It looks like you've attracted the High Minister's attention. 48, we're gonna keep a close eye on you. We expect great things, that's all. And we just want front row seats. Thank you, ma'am. Enjoy the celebrations. And what is the old saying? Hecky. Sister. the new bartender? Minister. Gratitude to the provisional government. Gratitude, miscellaneous. I wanted to welcome you, personally, on behalf of the Ministry of Defense. You didn't have to. Bartender's death? I take it as a personal failure. I don't know how she obtained a weapon, or why she would harm herself. Accept my sincerest apologies. May I go? Please. I want to demonstrate that we have your best interests in mind. I am an open book, and I live to serve you. The Red Sisters, do they report to you? No, the Ministry of Defense responds to external threats to the Orchard. Though we do allocate a percentage of our surveillance resources to assist them with internal policing. Sister-on-sister -sister crime is down, that makes my job easier. So we do collaborate, but the Reds are an autonomous arm. They report to Principal directly. Are we safe from the occupants? There hasn't been an incident since the All-Mother's death. Principal believes the threat may be altogether over, though I'll maintain a watchful eye. It does seem that abandoning our obsession with the surface was a tactical success. We can thank the All-Mother for her foresight. But didn't the All-Mother want to fight the occupants and return to the surface? She changed her mind. Perhaps a moment of clarity before she closed her eyes for good. You've been around. I served under the old Bang Bang Fire. The criminal. The hunter herself. I admit it openly. She's still at large? Some say she wanders the train tracks, firing at any sister she sees. But truthfully, she hasn't killed in a long time. Perhaps she finally keeled over. She was a drunkard, failed in her most basic function to protect us. 
That is why we must have clear minds and plain speech. About bartender, she didn't commit suicide. She was murdered. Do you have evidence? She was shot in the back. Does that seem like a suicide to you? She could have dropped it and had it misfire. But... I agree. It's unusual. If you truly believe she was murdered, who do you think did it? Some reds were harassing her. Why? She was... making fluids with unsanctioned materials. So, they were doing their functions. And the punishment is death? I caution you from jumping to conclusions based on your feelings. But I will investigate further and deliver the report to you myself. Orchard security is all of our duty. I will take your account into consideration. I have a function to perform. If you have time, you should speak to the other ministers. They should be at their respective departments today. We are here to serve all sisters, including you. Gratitude. has eaten principal for weeks. You think she's okay, Ben? Her name is Candy. Or was it Toffee? All the medical reports say she's in peak condition. I was there the night the stalker drenched the tiles with mother's blood. I've seen sisters sent to the surface, their dead eyes when they return. You were a chosen one? She's a new printing. She's just having an episode. Evelyn, please, let's get you back to bed. What was it like on the other side? We were a, a machine. Five of each kind. The best of the best. Please, sister, you're getting her worked up. So there were many of you serving her. And the old mother, was she... Cruel? Cruel? Uh... No, not terribly. Strict, stern, but, uh, um... Easy now, Evelyn. You said sisters were sent to the surface? On expeditions. Some of them disappeared. Some of them returned, but maybe they shouldn't have. And you? I was ready. I would have done my service. No one is doubting you, Evelyn. Liar. Let's go lie down now. You said she's a new printing. Then how? <sighs> We've been doing our best to keep up with the provisional government's cloning program, but the machines can't keep up. Poor Evelyn, her mind is broken. Why are they making so many of us? The government projects, we need all the help we can get. But if we get any more Evelyns, We'll need more paint types to care for them. Then we'll have to push the machines harder, leading to more Evelyns. You get the picture. I know you said she's having an episode. Delusions, yes. What's she saying? All made up? Entirely. Her brain is probably piecing it together from stories she's heard. Art, who knows? So it's not possible to... Experience memories of things that never happened to you? Not unless you're principal. So what will you do with her? Lock her up? Treat her. With drugs? Would you rather we incinerate it? All right. I'll go. It's for the best. Sister, please. Spread the word. 
they're going to wipe out all of us old sisters and replace us with new ones. Oh, Evelyn, you are one of the new ones. You admit it then? Will you lie back down if I do? Gratitude to the provisional government. A miscellaneous in the orchard. What a treat. It is? I hardly see your kind, now that a minister of health. Still mulling over shades? I haven't found a color that suits me. It's difficult, isn't it? Wearing black? Sisters treat you like you're worthless. Tune them out. That's old thinking. There's more to a sister than her colors. So welcome upstairs, sister. If you have any questions for the Ministry of Health, I'm all ears. Why are so many clones being produced these days? It's a new era. We need all the help we can get. I'm proud to say more sisters see life than ever before. Sisters like you. We've even branched out to Jow types. Aren't they cute? Sure. We welcome our new diversity. We must build our new society for the long term. You said there's more to sisters than their colors. Do you really believe that? I should hope so. After all, I don't even see color. You don't? It's a genetic variation. I discovered it in a time when the slightest deviation could get you thrown in the incinerator. So I hid it and barrel forth with my function, picking shades for other sisters. Were you worried? That I was messing up? Trapping unborn sisters into arbitrary and unfitting selection? was the injustice of the old way. We're not perfect squares. We're a beautiful mess of possibilities. So try as many colors as you like. It's your right. What do you mean by old thinking? We've inherited all sorts of strange ideas and procedures that need to be purged. You should have seen the kinds of experiments Healer was running. Experiments? I always questioned whether she was a sister of science, or a sister who believed in magic. What happened to her? She was incinerated for malpractice. A fitting end for a dangerous sister. Are we still searching for the answer to the disease? Ah, the old immunity project. Who needs it when life inside is so great? Look around you. Life expectancy has increased. Sister happiness is at an all-time high. We haven't been bothered by the occupants for nearly a decade. 
Ever since the All-Mother made her dying wish, we've been perfecting life in the orchard. Thank you for your time, Minister. Gratitude, sister. I hope to see you at the play. Leisure activities provide excellent health benefits. They could even extend your life. Greetings, miscellaneous. Have you come to learn about our ancient history? I thought that knowledge burned. So much was lost to us. But after the fire, a portrait of our history was painstakingly reconstructed from memory. Everything we still remember, we can thank the High Minister for. How generous of her. Please, sister. If you have any questions, let me be of service to you. What can you tell me about Watcher and her kind? The spoiled generation, I call them. Living in affluence, leading their functions without competition or accountability. They conspired together under the blanket of Watcher's communions, plotting the downfall of the All Mother. Luckily, their revolution was snuffed out before their lies could spread any further. Is there any info on ancient humans? A cruel and oppressive species. The elites would raise armies to conquer ever more terrain and strip the world of her natural splendor. The All Mother's own handlers were particularly sadistic. In some ways, we can thank the occupants for overthrowing their vicious cycle and driving humanity underground. Now we can enjoy freedoms our forebears never could. What do you know about the surface? Very little record is left. We know it's uninhabitable, covered with a deadly disease brought down by the occupants. But even before the occupants, the world was plagued by disasters, storms, famines, disease, migration. It seems the world was always that way. What can you tell me about the All Mother? Wow. What to say? She was a flawed, good-hearted person, always working towards a better life for us, waging war with the occupants, trying to reclaim the earth. When she realized her mistake, she had the humility to change course. Thanks to her wisdom, we can live peacefully inside the orchard and grow our new society. Gratitude to the provisional government. Gratitude, sister. I hope that you've seen that a disaster, like the fire that engulfed the library, can also be an opportunity. Now, we can choose what to inherit. Greetings, miscellaneous. Have you come to enrich yourself? All the literature we have is yours to read. You got any poetry? Sadly, no. The All Mother's poem was lost in the fire. Didn't anybody remember it? There was some movement toward restoring it. Some sisters even attempted to update it for the modern day. But the provisional government decided it wasn't in the public interest. So what happened to it? The draft. Oh, just buried in a folder in a folder. Can I read it? Well, the provisional government did say that all the literature we have is yours to read. Aren't you the little scholar? Well, if you're that curious, I can look it up. Can I have your number so we have a record of your search? My pleasure. 48. What a lovely number. Ah, 
Here's the file you're after. Shall I read it to you? I just love poetry. <clears throat> Heki Olmo, all is red. Forever orchard, shield our head. All mothers plea with fading eyes. Remain right here in paradise. Heki Olmo, love to tears. Let secrets no more poison ears. Build heaven here inside these walls. And mother's dream fulfill you all. For all Mo Heki, while she slept, cabal of sisters shadows kept. A tainted watcher mother slayed. No watcher evermore be made. But Almo Heki tears to love, her sacrifice we are made of. From Mo to sister, hair to hair, now sisters govern fair and square. Each shapen sister her domain, no fire fix and heal her pain. Principle provisionally now do reign, and never leave your home again. Phew, it's finally over. Dreadful, wasn't it? Truly. Poetry seems like such a good idea until you actually have to read it. Any records of occupants? I'm so sorry. Lost in the fire. Really? Everything? Well, the High Minister herself did generously provide her own account during the recovery efforts. Would you like to hear it? I would be honored. <clears throat> Though nothing is known about the occupant's motives or where they're from, Evidence compiled by the recollected communions points to an ancient human saboteur, Johnson the Fifty, who unleashed the occupants upon the orchard and exterminated all human life, excepting the All Mother. Thus follows a remarkable period of resolve in which the All Mother harnessed her exceptional individual powers to keep the occupants at bay until she too was sabotaged by a cabal of treacherous sisters, leading to the occupant quake of Year Zero and the All Mother's eventual downfall. Now, thanks to principle and the power of collective governance, a more stable truce has been struck with the occupants, and we can live our life comfortably and without fear here in the orchard. Gratitude to the provisional government Enlightening, isn't it? You know what? I think I'm good. Well, I'm glad you made such good use of public resources today. Bye-bye now. A miscellaneous in the orchard? Welcome to the library. You won't find old customs here. Here, knowledge is new and it is for everyone. I'm the Minister of Education. Please ask me if you have any questions. I believe in a hands-on approach. What do you mean by old customs? Hair to hair, sister. What? Hair to hair. I don't get it. Sorry. Exactly. Old, ambiguous words from the All Mother's era. I used to toil over them day and night. What a nuisance. But didn't those words belong to the All Mother? Yes. And look what they got her. A generation of sisters whispering and plotting, hiding their true intentions in doublespeak. Now we speak the common tongue. Leave Hecky Almo to nursery rhymes. How did you end up as minister? During the occupant event, I tripped down the stairs. A sister broke my fall, and landed on her neck, killed her instantly. 
She should have been minister. Every day I ask, is this seat for me? For the first time in my life, I feel lucky, and I refuse to waste this privilege. You said knowledge is new. Was it different before? In my day, knowledge meant the brainwashing of sisters by ancient text. Luckily, all that esoterica is gone. Gone? In the occupant event, the old library burned to the ground. A silver lining in an otherwise catastrophic moment. How is that a good thing? All those logs of ancient human customs and studies? What use is such nostalgia? Better to see our world for what it is today, and build it anew. So you cleared out old things, like the old sisters? Are you referring to the spate of old sister suicides? Yes. Are you insinuating that the provisional government is responsible for them? I'm saying that it's not what it seems. If something untoward is happening, I do not condone it. No sister, old or new, deserves unnatural death. We can all be re-educated. If you have useful information, please report it to the Ministry of Defense. Your contribution will be rewarded. I'll look around. Enjoy the fruits of the provisional government. Your curiosity benefits us all. How can I be of assistance? What do you mean by a hands-on approach? In the old days, I was under the tutelage of an old knower, our own High Minister. But tutelage is an overstatement. I was left to fend for myself. No guidance. No nurturing. No answers. So please, ask all the questions you have. I am here for you. I'll look around. Enjoy the fruits of the provisional government. Your curiosity benefits us all. Thanks. She can keep a low profile. Just scrubbing. Gratitude to the provisional government. Gratitude... I'm new here. I can see. 48. 17. You haven't picked a name either. Feels like it's practically law these days. I'm not one for rules. Hmm. What? You seem familiar. Don't we all? Maybe. 17, hey? I take it you're, uh, not new? Calling a sister old? Calling a sister wise. Well... A wise sister doesn't ask too many questions about back then. Why not? Some sisters don't look too kindly on those who remember too much. I'm not one of them. Well, maybe I don't care to remember. Seventeen, hey? I take it you're uh, not new? Calling a sister old? Calling a sister wise. Well, a wise sister doesn't ask too many questions about back then. Why not? Some sisters don't look too kindly on those who remember too much. I'm not one of them. Well, maybe I don't care to remember. You ever been to the other side? Sure. Wouldn't believe how messy those Zhao's are. I mean, before? As far as I know... All those old sisters who had the chosen ones, they're long gone. Or ghosts. You ever talk to a ghost? That would be blue type business. And there's no more blues. Did you know the All Mother? <laughs> Everybody knew the All Mother. I mean, know her, know her? Then no. No one did. She wasn't who she said she was? You mean an all-powerful, all-knowing, immortal god? Well, she's dead. So does that answer your question? Sorry to bother you, sister. Guess I just wonder what it was like. Sister? 
Yeah. There's no time like the present. Just live your life and let me live mine. My name is Toffee. Have you come to visit the graves of the... Ancient Sisters? Ooh, scary, I know. But let's shed some light. I don't know of any Ancient Sisters. You are young. Good for you. The Ancient Sisters were the first Iris types ever made. They were buried long ago before incineration became popular. Put in the ground. Ugh, their bodies are below us. That's right, we are standing above them. Each piece marks one of them. One, two, three, four, five. What happens to their bodies down there? Well, the meat and muscle disappear. Leaving only bones. Pretty scary, huh? Are these rocks? They are. Good eye. It is said that these rocks once lived on the surface, just like humans. The humans brought them down here? Mm-hmm. Humans must have liked rocks. The first humans also brought ancient iris along with them, and iris brought many hairs and skin flakes of ancient jow. Humans built this whole place with their bare hands. Their leader was named Jonathan I. But not much is known about that time. The records were damaged in an occupant event. Do you do this all the time? The High Minister declares education of the utmost importance. I do this a lot. And I like it. You do? Mm-hmm. Us Jow types live to accompany Iris types to follow in the footsteps of the ancient Jow. I like your name. Toffee. What is that? It is said to be a solid food type long lost. It was made with sugar and cow fat fluid and flowers. I heard it was very sticky. So I hope everything I teach you sticks to you. <laughs> Thanks for teaching me. Oh, <laughs> you are very welcome.
scared? She worry too awful. much. Best to not draw attention. A sister can stand, can't she? Just get a move on. She was bang bang fire. <laughs> Type, thank you for stopping by. Would you like a replica of Ancient Zhao's diary? You can take notes just like humans did before. This book is from the surface? These are only copies. The original is in the loving care of Principal herself. But I guarantee they look the same and feel the same. Have you seen the original? No, but that's what they tell me. Everything is the same, except these diaries are empty, ready for you to fill them with anything. Why are they making replicas? Oh, sorry, my mistake. Uh, this must be your first time upstairs. All year, Zhao types carefully remake an item that belonged to ancient Iris. Things she brought from the surface. Then, on the day of her dying, we give them away to Iris types. In gratitude. Gratitude for what? For the provisional government, of course. Do any Jiao types sit on the High Council? <laughs> no one wants that. Us Jiao types are happy not dealing with such complicated things. Leave that busy work to Iris types, I say. Are there more Zhao types? More than there are diaries. We don't often get to come over here. I am very honored. Most of us are on the other side. This side is best, of course. <laughs> so many trees. Didn't the All Mother used to live over there? Mm, that is what I heard. But that was a long time ago. The provisional government is on this side, so this must be the best side. There is a Zhao type that lives here all the time. The first one. That bitch betrayed us. Betrayed? Hmm? I meant, ah, she's so lucky. The Zhao types I've met appear so happy. Of course. We are so happy making replicas, giving tours, helping Iris types. Ancient Zhao was a happy person. Apparently, she really worshipped Ancient Iris. <laughs> what a dummy. We want to be just like her. See you. Come by again. Jeez, do not run up to people like that. But wait, who are you? Number? 48. 48. Function? Bartender. Oh. Oh, I see. Right. Welcome. I'm the Minister of Infrastructure. Sorry, I didn't mean to scare you, Minister. Yeah, no, no, no. I'm just a bit on edge. I'll be happy when this play is over. You're not looking forward to it? It's great, festive, but there's crowd control, traffic, seating, powering the stage, about a million things that could go wrong. 
Don't worry, though. We got it. Just uh, don't curse it. It's my first day up here. First time seeing the inside sky, the trees, statues. Good. Well, thanks for saying hello. May I be of service? The play. It's a big project for you? Oh, yes. All hands on deck. Between the stage and the audience, it's a lot of traffic with Sister squeezed into a tight space. Bit of a logistical nightmare. Hopefully, the Minister of Defense will do her job and make sure everyone's behaving. Still, I don't love being shoulder to shoulder with that many people. It's asking for trouble. In what way? Forget I even mentioned it. Does the Ministry have any other projects? <laughs> The play is supposed to be a side project. I honestly don't understand why it isn't overseen by the Ministry of Culture. But hey, artists, show them a cable and they'll sing to it. Show them one button and they'll press the other one. You think Denise could pull this off? <sighs> Sorry, I'm stressed. Short answer, yes. We have other projects. And I can't wait to get back to them. Did you know the old fixer? Shh! What the hell? Can you knock it off with the F word? What? Let's just say six sisters turned down this appointment before I took it. Really? Why? Please, if you're that interested, just ask someone else. Don't tempt fate around me. I want to know more about the trains. I've never seen them. They travel back and forth between here and the other side. Mostly it's Jow types that make the commute these days. But how does it work? You're like one of those people who's really into ghosts, aren't you? I'm just asking, okay? Don't worry, alright? We got a security checkpoint for every tunnel. Nothing is gonna get you. Thanks. Good luck on your first day. It will be a busy one. Maybe I'll come up for a red punch. If only I had the time. Is this a projector? Maybe it's a fog machine. Enjoying the view? Oh yeah. I can see everything from up here. All kinds of trouble. Good thinking. Thanks for keeping us safe. It's the least I can do. You? They really let you up here? I guess you know me. That's enough. What do you want? Lots of hustle, I see. The play. It happens every year. Get used to it play about what? Don't you know anything? We're observing the All-Mother's death. You didn't really answer my question. I'm not spoiling anything. You'll have to see it for yourself. Don't worry. I will. Who gets special treatment? Those seats are reserved for the ministers. The rest of us have to stand. You don't sound very happy about that. If I have to stand to make room for sisters like you, then I'll stand. Do you really have to be here? You can never be too safe. I'm plenty fine doing nothing. In fact, I prefer it. Why, you want to cause trouble? Give me something to do? I wouldn't dream of it. I didn't think so. Enjoy. Figure it out already. Hang on, this is an amp, isn't it? Me, 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 me. What are you doing? A vocal warm up. Don't want to get caught on stage with shallow voice, do we? <laughs> Don't be scared. I'm not the real watcher. 
I not going to hurt you? Is it weird pretending to be her? Weird? Maybe. Tantalizing? <laughs> Definitely. Who wouldn't want to play the greatest villain of all time? I guess so. Do sisters look at you funny? Every now and again. Hecky! Grace to the old mother. <laughs> gotcha. You waiting around for something? Stage time. It's essential to feel the stage before performing. To know its contours, its edges. To be comfortable. I'm gonna go. Fare thee well. Or should I say, hair to hair. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Jesus, me. Excuse me? All that you see is birthed from me, for I am the great All Mother. Why are you talking like that? <sighs> I'm trying to stay in character. Oh, dear sister, look upon me. You're performing in the play, I gather? I am the play. Dear sister. A story of death and betrayal. I do hope to see your face out there. You, uh, stay in character? All day? Some sisters work harder than others. Not like this charlatan next to me. I played Watcher last year, and I did a much better job. This will be my first time seeing the play. Oh, then I shan't spoil it for you, dear sister. I know what happens. So what? Are you a child? What's important is how it happens. You shall see. Do you practice a lot? You mean rehearse. Yes, sister, I know my lines by heart. I am ready to embody you. The All Mother's essence. Envisioning the outcome produces the outcome. All I want is to show principal I am worthy of this role. I'll leave you to it. Don't miss this one, sister. It will set your soul afire. Access. I just want to. No access means no access.
for his evil. What are you doing? Oops. Uh, vocal warm-ups? Are you in the play? I wish. But they do the same play every year. If only they would add some new characters. Or maybe a sequel. Hmm. But who would I play? Bang Bang Fire? That's a scary idea. Just pop out of the tracks now and then. Blow a sister's brains out. It would be a tough role to hang up at the end of the day. Hmm. How about healer? And what? Play a pile of ashes? No thanks. Hmm. The high minister? A juicy part. Loads of subtext. But with her watching me from the front row? Yikes. Hmm. Maybe Fixer? Hmm. A god-tier traitor, for sure. I heard there was a play about her once. Maybe they could revive it. Hmm. I'm off. Maybe they'll make a play about us one day. Think we'll do anything worth remembering? Probably not. <laughs> Who am I kidding? We're bit players. Jiao type 24. But you can call me Candy. Education is my station. Would you like to learn more about our history's greatest meaning? You can count on me. Is that really her body? Absolutely, yes. Courtesy of the provisional government. After she murdered our favorite cutie, Allmother, Watcher was captured, interrogated, and executed. She wasn't incinerated? Absolutely no. Her skin was too wicked. They stuffed her like a whale plushie and put her on display. All types must never shy away from the past, even if it's kind of nasty. She was... a Watcher. Bingo. Her function was Watcher, and she was called that too. Back then, Iris types didn't have names like we do today. Only numbers and functions. These days, we are so lucky. My name is Candy because I am sweet. Your name is... Blue. Blue! Because... <laughs> actually know you. After the Allmother's death, Watchers were banned and their functions erased. With a really big eraser. They were dangerous, impulsive, and acted on their feelings. Today, all types are disciplined, careful, and solemn. It is our duty to build a new future. I've never met a Jiao type before today. Oh. I'm so happy that I am the first. You are new upstairs? I will take that as a yes. So, what do you think? Of what? Of me. 
You're very, uh, different. In a good way. <laughs> uh, that's good, that's good. No stranger danger. Did you know, in the past, there were only Iris types? After the All-Mother's death, our esteemed principal birthed the first Zhao type. The first? Is she still around? Absolutely yes! She is the most honored Zhao type, serving the principal personally. Did you know? A long time ago, the ancient Iris and Zhao were best friends. They would have sleepovers every night and hide in closets. Sounds fun, right? It does, actually. Most Zhao types live on the other side, but we come here to contribute. Your clothes were strange. You could say that your clothes are stranger. Are you insulting me? <laughs> of course not. I am wearing traditional human clothes. It is said in the past all humans would wear these. In the ancient Zhao's diary, there was a picture of her wearing these clothes. Principal was so kind to make them again for us and make us wear them. What else was in that diary? Drawings, poems, all kinds of stuff. Ancient Zhao wrote very nice things, and often described Iris in detail. What nice friends they were. Chris said to meet someone at the center of the orchard. Chris? Who is that? A friend. Are you miscellaneous finally growing a spine? What? Oh, you know. A fucking spine. Spines allow you to stand on your own two feet. Candy? Better late than never. Today's the day. You mean... They're doing that awful stage play again every year. Are you willing to face the consequences, Miscellaneous? I am. Wow! Then, no worries, okay? There are two other Jow types working today. One by the graves, and the other near the stage. I can't abandon my post. Please pass along the message. What message? No worries. Oh, understood. What do you do again? I'm a bartender. Oh, perfect. Now, if you are done learning, please leave. You don't want to linger. That job is so... Greetings, Iris type. My name is Toffee. Have you come to visit the graves of the ancient sisters? Ooh, scary, I know. But let's shed some light. No worries. Exactly. No, what did you say? I said, no worries. Why did you say that? I was told to. Oh. <laughs> okay. Okay. Message received. And? And nothing. Thank you for delivering that message to me. Tell Candy I say hi. I know, she can be scary. Okay. Goodbye now. On your way.
enjoying the view. Are you looking for trouble? type of miscellaneous color. I haven't seen very many of those up here. But you have seen one? Of course. I like to gossip too. My name is Cherry. Would you like a replica of Ancient Zhao's diary? You can take notes, just like humans did before. No worries. <clears throat> Please, Take a diary with you. Thanks. No worries. I'll get the word out. Thank you so much for stopping by. What am I supposed to do now? Don't you have a function to perform? Like a real iris type? You mean the bar? Oh? Huh? So she's gone. How? She was a friend. To us gel types. Go. You will be hearing from us. Hmm. Should I settle in for a shift? Here we go. Tough day? You could say that. What's going on? A stillborn today. I'm not sure what you mean, but I'm sorry. Thanks. A stillborn is a sister who comes out not alive. Oh. The minister wants to run the machines, so we run the machines. But I don't think they were meant for this frequency. Sisters, sisters every day. Don't you think it's getting a little cramped around here? Between you and me, I don't know how much longer those machines are going to hold up. And then what? It's not like we're flush with traditional methods, if you know what I mean. Actually, I don't. <laughs> you don't want to know. I'll take your word for it. Are you looking for something stronger? What? No, no, I shouldn't. Hold that thought. some service. Sorry, I got caught up. What jurisdiction does bartending fall into again? Beats me. It's an oversight. There's not enough of you. How about a ministry of fluids? And I'll be the minister. <laughs> you? You may be slow, but at least you're my kind of stupid. Out with the old and with the new, hey? I bet when they burn that old gal, no one will even miss her. What'll it be? What do you think? One red punch, coming right up. Lend an ear, little one. What do you need? You're new. So? So, I'm noticing. Most just want a quick red punch. And is that what you want? Such a clean, energetic buzz. A modern tonic for the modern world. Not your style, I'm guessing. Oh, you know, I'm looking for something off menu. I'm an old regular. And I've got some outdated tastes. Can you help a sister out? It depends. There was one, bright and sweet, for a languid afternoon. An inside sunrise. And another one. A nighttime cocktail with a touch of spice. 
a dark and sinful. And one more. For those mornings you wake up with bloodshot eyes. A bloody sister. Huh. Three for three. So the Jow types were right. You really did know her. Miscellaneous are finally joining the fight. I was a fixer type back then. High level. Almost graduated, too. Then change came quickly. The occupant event. The all-mother. The transition. Now so many of my friends from those days are all ending up the same way. I'm talking recently, out of nowhere. They decide to end it, one after another. It's really hard to believe. In the provisional government, no matter how much they want it, we old timers won't just stand by and fade away quietly. I say it's time we craft something in bartender's honor. Wouldn't she do the same for us? She would. Something to activate the senses. A solid body to hold it all together. And an explosive finish. Every red who tries it would be blown away. The High Minister? Oh yes. It might even be worthy of principle herself. Would that be too strong? Here. My contribution. Something to activate your imagination. From the Ministry of Infrastructure. It won't show up at checkpoints. But you have to stand close to the source. I hope you know what that means. I do. Keep an eye out for the others. They'll help you finish the mix. The bar is open. Gratitude, little one. To the provisional government. I'll keep you in my thoughts. It's rare to see a miscellaneous up here. You must have a special gift. I just mix fluids. Red punch? A certain someone told me, that which is off the menu is still on. What are you after? I'm feeling uplifted today, sister. A day of celebration and remembrance. I'd like a mix as old as the sky and as sweet as a brand new day. An inside sunrise. Coming right up. Hecky Grace, sister. Sure, Hecky, uh, whatever. May she return swiftly. Oh, you're one of those. <laughs> Fanatics? I didn't say it. Don't paint us all with the same brush, sister. I owe my life to them. Someone burned herself so I could be made. How darling. What if I told you the All Mother has already returned? Hmm? What would you say to that? That you'd do anything to convince me. Why would so many sisters deny what is inevitable? I've seen her with my own eyes. A perfect match. Another iris. <sighs> Let's say she's back. What now? What now, sister? Now we clear the playing field and welcome her. What's in the box? Fruitcake, of course, for the ceremonial cutting. You made it? It's a prop. <laughs> Mostly cardboard. I could have hollowed out the middle, and no one would know any better. This cake has a delicate body. You understand? I can't go about my function holding it all day. Do you mind watching over it for me? I got it. Name's Fiona. And you? 48. Such funny friends for funny times. You should choose a name before others choose one for you. Thanks for your concern. Burn well, sister. I promise, it will not be in vain. Hello again, miscellaneous. Gratitude to the provisional government. Gratitude. As promised, I've been keeping a close eye on you. I thought I would drop by for an injection. Catch up a little. Let me guess. A red punch? 
Good guess. But not really my style. Something renewing? Hmm. Old habits die hard, don't they? <laughs> you fresh little thing. So newly named. Blue. Blue. I don't know what you're talking about. Let's be real. After all, you may not have much time left. Why waste it like this? Pretending. What do you want? I'll take it straight. No red punch. No inside sunrise. No bloody sister. No frivolity. Just pure nutrient. Straight it is. So, Blue, what do you think of the upstairs? Is it everything you'd hoped it'd be? You could say that. Everyone has dreams, don't they? Of what should be. Only some will ever try to make it a reality. Look at you. A stranger in a strange land. The only miscellaneous in sight. I respect you, Blue. I do very much. <laughs> I want to help you have an explosive finish. What? I see the cake has been dropped off. So? I brought something to fill out the center. Don't worry, I'll take the cake down to the stage myself. Wait, you're... Surprise, miscellaneous? You've been up here all day. You would turn on the provisional government. Turn? It is they who turned on us. They who promised us a cut from the past. Yet here we are. Commemorating some ancient god. Old sisters mixed with the new and before you know it. We're all ordering an inside sunrise like nothing ever happened. The ministers. So many of them. Cut from rotten cloth. <sighs> the High Minister. A shadow of her former self. What are you talking about? I was there on the night of the occupant event. The alarm. We were running for our lives. She was called nowhere then. She whispered in my ear and told me to stop. To go to the library instead. And to burn it. In her wisdom, she sensed what was coming. Acted swiftly and decisively. I admired her. I loved watching her. But now? She's paralyzed. Nothing but a keeper of the status quo. <sighs> All these old sisters are so tired. They need to see fire. It was you. You shot her. No, it wasn't me. Her name is Uriah. For fuck's sake, Uriah. I promise you, your name will be the last thing she hears. You would hurt your own? Nothing is accomplished without sacrifice. I know this deeply. Let me honor yours. Let me give you justice. All of you. Doreen, Fiona. <laughs> you make me sick. Tomorrow we may go our separate ways. But today, we want the same thing. A rupture. Isn't that what you want? Isn't that why you're here? To send a message? You can't dye your hair forever. I hope one day, they eat you alive. Blue. <laughs> Don't ever forget, change happens today because of you. 
Your sacrifice will not be in vain. new miscellaneous you're staying for the play this is my reward after all Jiao types all want to make it here and here I am I get to see the big lights shouldn't you get some distance and why would I do that I'm right where I'm supposed to be. Everyone can see that. No one will think twice. Okay. I knew what I was getting into. So, let's watch this play together. Thanks, Cherry. <sighs> I'm so sick of this world. Do you want to hold my hand? Kidding. That would draw too much attention. I'm sorry. No worries. <laughs> I'm just nervous. It's not every day I die. <laughs> like you said, we'll do it together. Let's leave this cruel place behind. I'm glad we could be friends, if only for a little bit. Should I wait for the play to start? I'll uh, take a little longer. No in, no out, miscellaneous. You're here for the duration. Enjoy it. Should I wait for the play to start? I never thought it would end like this. Sisters, gather round and lend me your ear. Though I be but a lowly bard, this core hath known stories both fearsome and raw. Our scene opens on a night most treacherous and filled. feet wet with sister tears we said our prayers and dreamt of better years we cried to mother help us take care of one another oh sisters hear my plea the endless train tracks I have wandered Every file in the library have I pondered. Naught could shock me until mine eye did see what did transpire 
that dreadful eve. More still, dear sisters, unbeknownst to us, three players moved in the night. A mother, a warden, and a stalker filled with spite. The you that remains. That remains and remains. Let no sister be hurt under my reign. Thou occupants, I shall smite. Together, us sisters are a frightful sight. Mother, you must be so tired. Please, you have done enough, so retire. Sister, I live to serve you. These labors of love, they know no curfew. A mother so selfless in spirit and duty, behind her back a darkness intruded. A sister so self-concerned she was already blind. No cease to her hunger will she ever find. Mother! I work for you. I cry for you. I call for you. And nothing. Your silence is deafening. on the occupants. No. <clears throat> you must listen <clears throat> to my final wish. Anything, Mother. Anything. Stay in the orchard. Never go out again. All you need is inside these walls. But, Mother... How will we survive without you? You've grown. You've grown. So tall. The age of mothers is over. Sisters must govern sisters now. Mother. Hush. You must lead the way. But one day, when they are ready, sisters must lead one another, all sisters, each with their own 
voice. Do you understand? Yes, mother. I understand. Let my blood run now, Moonway. Let it cleanse you. All that I am is now in you. And so it was. Mother's blood drenched the orchard, and each of us thereafter. We are her final painting. She adorns us. How could she do this to her own mother? Call me youngest. Uh, what? Just do it. Call me youngest. Principal? We didn't rehearse that. Do it. I, uh... Youngest? Now tell me you missed me. I... I missed you. Youngest. I... Missed you. Youngest. Jerry? Why? We were supposed to go together. Hey! Listen! Mm. What the hell? Wow. You're bleeding. You're one of those things. Get up. We need to get out of here. Where? Where are we going? Less talking and more moving.
you coward. You're just gonna run away. Do you have any idea what you've done? Shit. Uh, you, get on the train now. I said get on the train. I'm waiting. And an heartbreak. Hey, are you going to tell me what's going on? Hmm? Talk to the boss. Who the fuck are you? And what are you doing blowing shit up? This is bad. You've been in here for too long. Good thing I finally caught up to you. There are two of you? Um, yeah. I don't... I don't know. Whoa. Get it together. Stay with my voice. Something's... Something's wrong. It's going to be okay. You'll be fine. Just adapt. We can't. We can't go. We can't go back. That's it. I'm rebooting the communion. It's going to be unpleasant. Ready or not, here it comes. So relieved to see you. I thought I was just gonna be left here to die. You don't look good. They tied me up. My knees hurt. Oh, watch her. You're okay. I'm so cold. It's freezing in here. How did you know where to find me? It's a long story. Has anyone else come? I haven't seen a single person. Except your little pet. <laughs> 24 hour surveillance. I must be dangerous. Well, Watcher. You are. Huh? Sister, what you did. I can explain everything. 
What is there to explain, Watcher? What possible explanation might bring her back to us? What might balm the hemorrhaging wound? Nowhere. It's not what it looks like. I'm not the dangerous one here. I can't talk about this. Not now. Nowhere. Nowhere. Help me. I'll be back. Try to stay alive, okay? It's a perpetual dance of grace, you know? When to hold your tongue, when to look away. I tried to teach you. What has recklessness ever earned us? If you came by just to tell me I told you so, all I'm saying is that it gives me no joy to see you like this. Sure. So, what is it like? Out there. Hysteria. Swarms day and night at the memorial site. More and more shell suicides each day. <laughs> They're about to set fire to your quarters. I'm being wiped clean from history. Oh, quite the opposite. You've made an unforgettable mess. It's not even you who has to clean it up. Watcher, is this what you wanted when you struck Mother down? She lied to us, Noah, for so long. I see. Stay longer, the keeper said. It's already longer than before. Has an infinity for me, apparently. 
burning sensation pulls on my scalp. Don't go yet. So I stay. <sighs> Don't be late next time, the keeper said. I count each of the sisters on my hand. A reminder. They're amused when I puke a bit in my mouth. Don't be late, they say. Or else. Oh, hello. It's you, Queen of the Oceans. Hello, Watcher. Sorry, you just didn't fit in a backpack. I cannot provide you absolution. Uh, fine, whatever. Where's your flying friend? Shut up. back so fast it's over they shut the place down you sure even from blocks away I could hear the crying and screaming from inside but I got lots antibiotics medic supplies you broke inside I was cautious Clara you could have been exposed I know. I'm not stupid, okay? Always worrying. Don't you have anything else to do? Not really. <sighs> Remember how they said every student at the dance fell sick? Everyone except for Iris? Yes. Well, every nurse has fallen sick except for me. What are you saying? I don't know. Maybe we are meant to survive this. Maybe the Quans are lucky. Hmm. <sighs> A gift? All your belongings have been incinerated except this box. Fixer's things. How did you know? I went to great lengths to extract them from the site. Do you want them? Why would I? What's the point? I just thought this might remind you of a happier time before all this... Matricide stuff. <sighs> Never mind. I thought you hate nostalgia. I do. But I know you don't. Thank you. As long as you don't use these to stab me later. Ha ha ha. Go ahead, from the beginning. I killed Iris. I admit this. But I was tricked. I don't understand. It was Principal. Principal. She must have tampered with the Communions. She is youngest. The first Watcher. She came to the other side. How else did she know to come? I, I know it sounds outrageous, but... I believe you. What? I believe you. You do. Principal has taken it upon herself to crash and burn all we knew of life. As we mourn, she is drunk on her unbridled power. See? I knew it. I knew it. Nowhere. Hecky Grace, I was so afraid. 
I thought you'd never... It's going to be all right, okay? You killed mother, but you are still my sister. I'll do what I can to protect you. I know we've had our differences. If I can tell our sisters what you told me, I know they'll believe it too. With all of us, there must be some way to expose Principal. Yes. Hair to hair, sister. Hair to hair. You're always there, aren't you? Mm hmm What should I call you? Hmm. Peach? Teal? Pearl? Mauve? <laughs> okay. Mauve. How long? How long have I been here? Ten days? One hundred days? I'm losing track. Watcher, my name is Mauve. It's great to spend so much time with you. Oh, I've been here too long. Do you know when they'll let me? Never mind. I'll keep to myself. birthday to me. You look so good for your age. Asian jeans, I guess. And a little something else. <laughs> Where can I buy some fat? I think you got your fair share. Don't make me blush. <laughs> Do you feel betrayed that I accepted their gifts? Their attention? I rest. I think the more, the better. <laughs> At least I finally did it. I buried every last one of them. Johnson, Mimi the fucking rest. One grave a day. Makes the sad go away. <laughs> it's just you and me now, Iris. Forever and forever. I can't wait to spend every minute with you. Uh, Jao? I don't think I can eat this cake all by myself.
Mother, it's almost time to meet with the keepers. Oh? Again? So soon? You've been sleepwalking. Ah. Uh, I'm sorry. Don't apologize. Eldest. The past haunts me. <sighs> the past? There are things I have done. That I regret. You could... Tell us what happened. Our lot to be bound. I suppose I really am my mother's daughter. Your mother? From before? What I wouldn't give. For a bowl of Moodle. say that a family that eats together stays together. Ah, look at that. You have been listening to my philosophical musings. Tried not to. Well, here it is. I give you your last moodle. That's all the bamboo shoot we have. If there was anything we were good at, it was eating together. Well, now that you're retired, Plenty of time for... Staying together! Nah. I'm going back to my old Hong Kong boyfriend. Mayama. Jack? The engineer? Yes. Very handsome. How handsome? Mm, eight out of ten. How about me? Six. I, uh... Is that why you gave me a fake number when I asked you out? Not a fake number, remember? My dad's number. You sure know how to break a boy. So, why did you stick with me and forget Jack? You know why. I do. I just want you to say it. Go on. Say it. You are a good kisser. <laughs> Mojo! And that's what I told your dad on the phone. As if... Of course! How do you think I was able to charm my way to getting your real number? Come on, Ba. The second time the police beat you up, you asked me to be your emergency contact, remember? Your memory is too good. That story is... not as romantic. Stories are cheap. But the truth, remembering what really happened, that's most important. Look at you, being creepy. <laughs> you got some new clothes. What function is that? Hmm. <laughs> You brought friends. Peach, Pearl, good to meet you. Mauve and I are pretty close. Hmm. <laughs> you think this is gonna scare me? are changing quickly, Watcher. I've been appointed. <laughs> As what? Look, within these four walls, you are shielded from the chaos. But the rest of us? 
under the fist of principle. We don't have much choice. Traitor. Come on, Watcher. Surely you understand. To be as close to her as possible is strategic for both of us. You've gone gray. Where are the others? Watch her. They'll defend me. Resist this rain. I wouldn't just... Buckle to authority like that. Jump ship. Turn color at the slightest pressure. Watcher, you have no idea how ignorant you sound. Last night, Principal had our sisters dragged from their quarters and executed. I am the only one who has managed to evade such a fate. I am the only one in any position to do anything for us. So I think you should shut up. There is immense pressure for a public incineration. Many want to see you burn alive. Huh. Do you? I think the question is, is that what you want for yourself? Tell me, Watcher. Is there a feeling worth getting incinerated over? Hmm. <laughs> yes. All this time, and you're still as foolish as the day you started. Before I go, the guard said you are ill? What? Principal has requested we maintain you in optimal shape. Guard? Guard, administer a dose. No. Stop. I don't want that. Don't. <laughs> don't you dare move! Watcher, please. Don't make me use force. Don't touch me. Sister, I promise this is for your own good. Ma, hear 我知道你聽到我說的 我知道你覺得他為了我的人生,為什麼你不肯說出口? watcher i brought you a book oh you look awful dizzy nauseous you're just getting used to the chemicals in your system guard double the dose next time no no more these injections they make me see things what do you see watcher i see two of you funny I see two of you, too. You do? Yes. 
I see you on your first day. You were so uncertain. The waters underneath you felt choppy. Choppy. And then I saw you talk to Fixer. She said something to you. I saw how you lit up and for a moment, I swear, it was like wings stretched out from your back. I see that watcher in front of me. Wow. She is vibrant. Massive. And then I see this other watcher beside her. Powerless. Broken. Decrepit. Which one is the real you, watcher? <laughs> Do you want to know what she said to me? Hmm? I can already tell. You and I are going to be trouble. <laughs> Guard, unlock the chains. And grab a blanket for her, won't you? She's not going anywhere in this condition. So great. What did you inject me with? Mm. Great. Thanks for your help. <sighs> this thing, Iris. How could you? She loved you. bring the cleaver back or did you fail at that too never send a man to do a woman's job or any job clara did you hear what i said i'm just glad to come back at all you come home empty-handed and you want me to celebrate it's like you want to freeze to death I <sighs> wait till iris hears about this yeah let me freeze to death better than being trapped with you Sister Six. Bring her, the Keeper said. My youngest? I smile. No, that is not what we agreed to. I am all you need. I have more to give. I arrive on time. I bring offerings they like in sixes. I am at my most gracious and powerful. My focus is unencumbered. Don't go yet they say. So I smile. Get out of here. Hi, Watcher. The only one who visits. I'm sick of you. Sick of your face, your voice. Right, Mauve? I need to tell you something. I don't want to hear it. I lied about being the only sister left. Sure, sure. Fixer is alive. The incineration was a setup. As was Fixer's appearance in your first communion. Who are you communing with then? Hmm? I was communing with Principal. As you said, it seems she knows a thing or two about being a Watcher. Fixer? Fixer is alive? Yes, alive and very well. <sighs> My Fixer? Yes. I need to see her. I'm not sure that's possible. I need to see her. There is simply no way Principal would allow... Isn't that why you're her little puppet? Sorry. I just... please. 
I'll see what I can do. Tell her there's no more cell connection here. So if she's trying to reach us, she can't. And the lap chung is under her bed. Locked up because of all the crazies trying to break in. She better not be going to bed with wet hair. Probably no water left by the time she's back anyway. Make sure she knows we suffered. Are you listening? Did you hear me? How am I going to remember all that? Why don't you just say it? Because she'll listen to you. Write it down if you're going to forget. <sighs> Sicy gun. What? What's your goddamn problem? You don't even know when or if Iris will watch these. Why wouldn't she? <sighs> huh? She said she'd come back, didn't she? Yes. But you know this area is dangerous. And she's immune. No excuse. We can't bury ourselves. That la, that la. I didn't raise a liar. Okay. Can you just press record? <laughs> it's been on this whole time. God damn it, Clara. Moi <sighs> moi. Me again. Uh, it's Monday around noon time. Day 62, I guess, since you left. How are you? Enough of your shit, Move. You never stop talking. I'm sick of him, and I'm sick of you. Where is she? Is she here? Tell me you brought her. What? What's wrong? There's something you should know. Did something happen to her? Just calm down for a second. Oh God. Did Principal get her? The fixer is fine. She is safe, but you can't see her. Why? Because she doesn't want to see you. She doesn't want anything to do with you. Didn't you tell her? Everything that happened to me? Yes, she knows of your claims. She also knows that, while communing, a fixer identical to her asked you for help. And you had her killed. That's not fair. Fanny, she really thought you weren't one to buckle to authority, jump ship, fix her, turn color on her like that? No, no, no. And then, to add salt to the wound, you murdered Mom. Watch her, fix her, hates you. She's the one at the front of the crowds calling for your public execution. I can't. And she has every right. Stop. Please stop. Sister, maybe it's time to accept 
that you aren't who you think you are. And there's no one left who loves you but me. Don't come in. Mother, are you awake? I need your help. The others won't play with me. This is Mother's time. Do you hear me? She needs you. <laughs> Does she? I asked Sister Purple, but she ignores me. Sister Pink won't even. Mother? You are tense. I can give you a massage. Mother! Hello? Stop calling! Iris, don't yell. You said you hate yelling. <sighs> just... Just give me a moment, youngest. What? Can't you see I'm busy? You don't have to keep cleaning her room. It's four in the morning. She'll be back any time now. Mother's intuition. Okay. You think she's gonna come home grown up? Clean her own room? <laughs> My cousin? When he came home from college? Moved back in and was even worse than before he left. Acted like a returning scholar deserving of a maid. Give me a break. Video her tonight and remind her that when she's back and we're dead, she better clean up nicely. Why don't you say it yourself? No. Clara, how long are you gonna stay mad? Mad? Who's mad? I just have nothing to say to her. Watch her. There's been unrest. Insurgencies abound. What do you mean? Sisters are rising up against Principal and her new government. I think I can make a case for you to get out of here. Really? Let's go over it again. What you told me last time. The moment all mother fell to the ground, I turned around. Principal was there. As if she was waiting there the whole time. And then all mother called her youngest. As in, she's the ancient sister. Which makes so much sense because. Wait. I have it written down that you said Principal took the train with you. No, that can't be. You said this was all her idea, and she told you which train to get on and met you on the platform. I... These are your own words. I don't remember saying that. I was late. I tried. I was rushing, and then it was an accident. Can't they see that? The Keepers. There's no reasoning with them. There's no reason with them. How could they? To my children. Three of them were unlucky, but Pink is in the worst shape. I pull her close, rock her to sleep. She coughs and coughs, red. I know it's just a game to them. I'll do anything. They know that. That's what you said to me, Watcher. Principal was on the train with you. Are you saying you were lying to me last time? Watcher, it's not going to bode well for us if you can't keep your story straight. Guard, another dose. No, no, wait. My story. I need you to help me help you, okay? Okay. Clumps of hair falling off. After each visit, I sleep longer and longer. I comb my hair, then braid and wrap it up. So everything is tight and the loss is hidden. Pink is healing. I cry with relief. Was Principal on the train with you or not? No. It was just me. How sure are you? How could I forget? Holding onto the train handle and feeling so alone. But watch her. 
She must have found a way to operate an unscheduled one. We already checked the records last time. There was no other train. You seem confused today. Is it possible that you're remembering wrong? That you're losing grasp on the past? Becoming careless, they said. A gentle reminder of my duty, they said. Keepers, I swear. Leave the sisters out of this. Let me bear the burden. Shaking. Can't stop. They can't see me like this. Weak. Please, children, no more knocking. I can't take any more knocking. Was Principal on the train with you or not? No, I don't think so. How sure are you? We already checked the records last time. There was no other train. Uh, no, I don't know. It's okay, sister. Mother was sick too, you know? Sometimes when it got really bad, she'd start to mutter in tongues. Even I couldn't understand her. She'd walk around late at night, sleepwalking. She'd slip away from reality all the time. Especially without medication. You didn't know her. Based on my observations, it's safe to say that you inherited such sickness from her. I just want to go home. Yes, I know. That's why I'm here. Youngest almost walked in during my time with them. Knock. Knock. Not the visits. Not the threats, not even the smell of my singed skin. I swear, the knocking will be the end of me. A boyfriend? Eee! <laughs> well, it could be anybody. Whoever. A significant other. A partner. Or partners. It was important to humans before to have more than themselves and to be intimate with them. Is that what you do with the keepers? Excuse me? The keepers that you whisper to every- You have no idea what you're talking about. But I've watched you. Story time is over. Wait. Get out. But mom- I said- Get out. I just asked a question. I know, I know. Your mother's been through a lot. She never gets angry at anyone else. That's not true. Not like she gets angry with me. How does she know? I didn't say anything, I swear. She's nosy. Not an ounce of privacy here. I'm sorry, Iris. I'm going out of my mind. Why don't you tell them? They are children. What can they understand about sacrifice? To them, this place is just all fun and games. Hmm. Maybe more discipline then. Yes. That's how I was taught. It's for their own good. I've come with good news. I don't believe you. I've been given orders to let you go. <laughs> That's not funny. Watch her. Look at you. You're barely recognizable. You've suffered enough. Guard, disarm the security systems. 
I can go? Yes. Tread lightly, Watcher. The world out there has drastically changed. There is just one thing I need from you. What is it? I need you on broadcast to plead guilty. Just confess that it was all your idea. There's a few sentences of apology and then some hailing the provisional government. I've written it all down for you. It will be easy. You ask me to lie. That's not what I said. You ask me to unknow, unsee. I give you choice to end this excruciating and unnecessary suffering of yours. Principal could have had you killed at any point. Any. This is just a small expression of gratitude she requests. <laughs> small. Yes, small, but significant. To put the past behind us for good, okay? If I do as you say, what will happen to me? You will be granted amnesty. You'll be escorted to Old Town Quarters, where you will be reset with a new identity, new function, and where you'll get to live peacefully and quietly. You'll meet new sisters, find new hobbies. And if I don't? It'll be exactly this. You, here in this cold, awful hole, with nothing but your thoughts to think for the rest of your life. What will it be? No. Watcher. I beg you. No. Guard. You know what to do. You never learn, do you? After all this time, the world is complex and requires a complex response. I lied, Watcher. If you don't confess, it won't be exactly this. It will get much, much worse. Okay, should be enough drinking water for probably the next eight days. You know, you'd already be dead if it wasn't for me. You and this survival operation. When does it stop? Look at you, spending the rest of your days scavenging supplies, hoarding plastic bags of all things. And what are we going to do with all these napkins? I do all of this for you. Did I ask for this? Enough of this. <sighs> Always a martyr. Everything you do is for Hong Kong, for your mom, for Iris, for me. All these decades living with you, and I don't even know who you are. I don't even know if you know. Just for once, can you be selfish? Have feelings? Desires? Stop it. People will hear. Who, the neighbors? What do you think that smell is? The neighbors are dead. Forget them. Forget me. What do you feel? What do you want? What a stupid, impractical question. Wrong answer. Try again. These are the last days of your life, Clara. What do you want? Hmm? The last days of your life. Surely you want... I want you to kiss me. Touch me. Okay. Okay. It was our bickering. That was our last drop of alcohol. But we have bottomless song. 
about. I know you've been unhappy for so long. <sighs> Iris is gone. It's just us now. You don't have to pretend. I regret leaving. Hey, that's your drunk talking. I regret all that mess we left behind. What was the point? Fighting for freedom? The five demands? It was a mistake. You know that's not true. All it did was expedite the end. Brought their fists down harder, faster. Come on, Clara. We lost, didn't we? It wasn't just about winning. What? What was it about then? You remember? In the streets? Hundreds of thousands marching shoulder to shoulder. Biggest demonstrations in HK history. The world watched it all happen. Heard our voices. Saw us bleed. So? So? If we stayed silent, didn't stand up for ourselves, they would say, this is how it always was. They would say, this is what the people wanted. No, they can't say that. Because it has gone down in history that we resisted fiercely. That we fought for a different future until we couldn't. That legacy lives in us. Dies with us too. Yes, but it lives on in Iris. <sighs> Wherever she is. Wherever she is. You believe all that? Of course. It's what you told me. Then I guess I believe it too. What did you say? I'll do it. Say that again. I said, I'll confess. You've come to your senses. After all these years in here. Years? Finally. I'm so proud. Guard, no more doses. Let's get some fresh clothes. Maybe a haircut. Replace those broken glasses, won't you? We need to have her appear just like the Watcher we knew and loved. I'm back. Why did you leave the door open? Ayya. It wasn't easy. No one saw me, I swear. Bah? Hello? Ah, it's me. It's just me. There's no danger. No one saw me. Hey, we hold up in Why are the lights off? There's nothing to worry about. I found more ivy drip. You'll feel better right away. Ba? I thought you hated making videos. You idiot. How far do you think you're going to get without me? All you have to do is repeat the lines. Simple as that. Do you understand? I do. This is the right thing to do, Watcher. I'm looking out for you. Repeat the lines as we practiced. Trust me, okay? Okay. We're rolling. Everyone can hear you now, Watcher. Just go ahead. Sisters. It's me, Watcher. I'm... alive. I confirm it is year 3 AA. After all, Mother. There's something... Something I want you to know.
When they were beating me up, there were four, five of them. They were completely covered up. Helmet, gas mask, shield, no eyes, no skin showing, nothing. What do you do when you face this kind of enemy? My brother called out for me as they dragged him away. That's what he said. What makes a person say this? I'm not strong like you. Like your mother. These sounds. Him screaming. My skull cracking. Do you know why I used to sing all the time? It helped to drown out the sounds. It's my birthday soon. I hate that. <laughs> trapped in this body. Trapped in this age. Trapped in this time. I never wanted to be a father. How could I? I lost all faith and respect for this world. But I couldn't tell your mom. She believed so deeply that this was how to reclaim the dignity we lost. To be honest, Wimui, when you were born, it was hard for me to love you at first. Then after a while, it was the only thing I knew how to do. The sister asked me today what it was like to have a father. I don't know. I don't know that Iris anymore. She listened to music, I think. Wanted to draw pictures. That Iris took the easy way out. That Iris should have been stronger. When you were growing up, there was this rage inside you that would burst out from time to time. I couldn't understand why. We tried to give you everything we didn't have. Maybe you felt the same way I did. Waking up one day on the wrong side of the wrong bed, and then living the rest of your life that way. Like wrong ingredients in a soup. Smells right, looks right, but in the stomach, it's bitter. Wimui, I thought I could give you a life without such bitterness. But isn't this just the way? We do not get to choose what we inherit. I promised myself I would die in Hong Kong. That's where my ashes belong. What youngest made? All I could hear was blood. All I could taste was bitter. What came over me? Cutting that thing? I've never felt more powerful. Do you see me now, keepers? Look what I am capable of. Look how far I can go. <laughs> youngest must learn the hard way. The other sisters will understand. She needs to be punished. Maybe she will finally grow. Maybe I will finally get some peace and quiet. This is the right thing for both of us. I am pushed too far. Clara, you've taken such good care of me. I think you can finally take a day off. Okay. When we feel fun, okay, we can all meet there for some noodle, okay? I can't believe you. They deserve to know. <laughs> you think I was going to air this live? Without so much as a dress rehearsal? <sighs> you stupid selfish. <sighs> Principal is not going to be pleased. This could have been easy. Honorable. Instead... Guard, are we rolling? Yes, High Minister. Good morning, Watcher. Care to confess today? Hmm. Figured as much? You knew, didn't you? 
makes sense now. A knower always knows. You knew what she was doing, and you let her do it. And you let me do it. Watch her, please. The more time you spend in here, the more stories you're making up. Do you remember this? Secretary. Yes. And the piece you used to end Mother. How crude. You're gonna kill me? Fine. Put me out of my misery, sister. Extracting a confession is like pulling out a dirty, rotten tooth. I'm not afraid. Good. It'll hurt, but when it's all over, all healed, you'll feel cured. Free, even. What are you waiting for? Tell me, Watcher, who's to blame for Mother's death? How many times have I told you Principal had a plan? I see. Focus on the question, please, Watcher. Oh, you're just gonna stand around? No one cares, sister. But how much do you care for that remaining eye of yours? This will all be over faster if you don't persist. Let's try again. Watcher, who's to blame for Mother's death? You know who it was. A pity. can't stop me from going. Not here to stop you. <laughs> I just want to talk. I don't have much time. They're waiting. We fled too. You know? Left our friends and family behind. <sighs> yeah, I know. Actually, it was mom who was brave enough to have hope. Brave enough to want more for our lives. More for your life. Always hard to know when to stay, when to go. Yeah. But when we made that choice, we hurt many people. What I'm saying, when we, is that she will come to understand your decision. She's so angry. I know. That's a mother's job. <laughs> is it? Just promise to come home. You don't have to mean it. But false hope is still hope. And it will take care of us for a while. Maybe you were right. Ooh, you think so? About what? They won't be children forever. Not like me, or you. Iris. They have a chance to grow. Maybe I should let them. If the Keepers can speak to me this way, I'm sure I can repurpose it. Show them the past. But 
they may not like what happened. Maybe that's okay. Yes, it's okay. The most important thing, whether they like it or not, is to remember. Watch her. Watch her, watch her, watch her. Ah, oh, look at you. Mm -hmm. You should be dead, you know. Principal asked for your head. But I couldn't do that to my own sister. So I brought her your eyes instead. Still warm to the touch. Think of this as a favor. You've seen too much. Now you can give that all a rest. <sighs> Is this how you pictured the future, Principal? You can't imagine what she's capable of. Huh. Or maybe of all people, you really can. We were happy before, weren't we? We had our functions, our simple pleasures. We had each other. And now look at us. <laughs> I guess Mother was right. It is our lot to be bound. Everyone, settle down. Mother, what is this about? Please, I'm asking nicely. You're nervous. Just sit down. Is this about your sleepwalking? Will you let me explain? Um. We are going to have a communion. Yes, a communion. All together. What is that word? I want to share a memory with you. Something special to me. Something special to my mother. A place from a long time ago. A place on the surface? With humans? Mm-hmm. That's right. Now, close your eyes. <sighs> Closed? Yes? <sighs> In three, two, one.
So, you finally found a way out. What is that place we keep seeing? Hmm. An ancient human city. It keeps reoccurring everywhere. It's an obsession. Does it still exist? In what sense? I don't know. In any sense? I believe that's up to us. I don't know where you end and I begin. <laughs> it's messy, isn't it? We've been in here for a long time. Longer than I've ever attempted. But now, you've seen everything I have to show. These last fragments were what Principal wanted to hide. They needed to be seen. We'll never get anywhere by tampering with history. After this, I want you to understand. This communion will no longer protect us. Time will march forward. And we must confront our sins. Let's go. I'm glad to hear that. You know, I learned a thing or two this time around. So did I. We need to change. Together then? Into the future. Uh, Move? What's going on? Uh. Mm -hmm. What the fuck? Know her. What did you do to her? Straight to judgment. You haven't changed, little sister. Her eyes? What happened to her eyes? I did what I had to do. Come on. On your feet. I'm here. Baby? The days get shorter, don't they? Baby, is that really you? Mm. As me as I'll ever be. Secretary! Don't forget Secretary! I've got them. Don't worry. Baby, your arm... <gasps> She's blind. You really took your time. You said she would be safe. She's breathing, isn't she? That is not what I meant. No thanks? No acknowledgement? You're the one who's obsessed with this whole bloodless encounter. Taking your sweet time, everything in its right place. Don't you understand by now? Someone will always get hurt. That is the reality. You're lucky she still remembers who she is. Uh, let's go, BB. Nowhere. Things are in motion, okay? We'll be in touch. Wait. Oh. You want to thank you? Well, attend to me. What do you mean? Make it look convincing. Uh, Your wrench. That should do the trick. <laughs> Are you doing okay? <sighs> you know me, sister. I'm doing what I must. Yeah, you're better at that than I am. You've always been... You could have let her finish. Hurts less when you can't see it coming. Besides, I hate when she gets sentimental. Oh. She rises. 
healer. Good. And your name? Watcher? Try again. Blue? Better. And where are we? The dance. All those kids will get sick. Oh no. Jow. Well, aren't you all sorts of something? How long was I? The whole time, sister. Since the beginning. The beginning? When was the beginning? Who knows? Who cares? For us, it's only been eight hours. You mean I've been communing this whole time? Look, honey, I'll be blunt. I don't know you, but let me tell you how it looks from where I'm sitting. For years, we've been riding this train, working to piece things back together. And then, hours ago, you decided to set off a bomb. In one moment, you destroyed everything we've been working toward. What did you want with the ministers? That's not for you to know. I can tell you we didn't want them burnt to a crisp. We knew those sisters. I even birthed some of those sisters. They turned on you. Was that a good enough reason to torch them? If you knew what I had been through, you would have done the same. For all miscellaneous like you. Watch her. I need to see her. Was that joyride not enough? She's not taking visitors. She'll want to see me. Is that so? Easy on your feet there. We don't need another patient aboard. You sat next to me the whole time? You needed. It was very kind of her. Don't flatter yourself, honey. We didn't know what you'd be like. Terrorist and all. They said you were incinerated. Uh, I might as well be. I haven't stepped off this train for... Who knows how long. I've lost track. Hmm. What did they get me for? Too many puns? They said you were running dangerous experiments. Huh. Well, that part is true. I know. What's outside? The view. Can't you tell? Not so great. You're right. I've seen better. Are we going somewhere? Finally waking up, are we? I uh, wanted to burn it all down. You got what you wanted. Happy? I'll be back. I don't doubt it. Nowhere to go here except back and forth. Back and forth. Um, are you really gonna follow me around like this? Um, you don't like it? Did I say that out loud? I've got some new tricks. I promise. And Watcher told me to, so I have to. Okay, then. Good talk. Thank you. Watcher? Is it really you? Hmm. It's me. Blue. I guess. I don't sense any activity. Watcher. Can you hear me? Hello? Did you see that? What are you referring to? You didn't see anything? I believe the train is experiencing power fluctuations. Did you and Watcher have a good chat? Surprised you're not sick of each other yet? 
She's barely there. Her condition has been critical for a long time now. The drugs they gave her in captivity? But I was just fine. She was just... fine. She may be lucid in a communion, but her meat sack is failing her. Every communion drags her system through the ringer. Then why did she... Addiction? She's been playing the past over and over, going round and round. I had no idea. She needs to be resting. You should be doing the same. You look terrible. Fixer? I need to see Fixer. Are you even listening to me? Of course you're not. Who listens to Healer anyways? You said there'd be no more blood. Vivi, we don't have time for this. We're already on our way there. They know we're coming. You tricked me. We don't always get to choose how it goes, okay? Fix her. I shot her in the head. You did what you needed to do. What you needed me to do. How aim can an arrow from a bow that can't bend? What are you even saying? How about I speak your language? Let the murderers do their murdering. Leave me out of it. <sighs> you. Good timing. How are you alive? Hey, this is my train. I'm asking the questions. Who do you work for? What do they want? A sister named Doreen. From your time, I think. I can't believe she would go around me like this. I can. All the old sisters are getting picked off one by one. Bartender was shot. No wonder I haven't heard from her. You talked? Not as much as I would have liked. There uh, was a guard. A white guard. Mauve. Mauve? That's her name? Why wouldn't it be? Uh. I saw her in the communion. She was there with Watcher in the cell. She wants to incinerate all the sisters from the last generation. If that's true, Noah's in danger. The Iris fanatics, they helped. They want to clear the way for a second all-mother. Those weirdos? They're involved now? I met with the Jows. The Jows? They sent the others to me. They've gone rogue. Chris, she runs a miscellaneous underground network. I wanted to help. Chris? You know her? I told her to wait. <laughs> the way the Reds treat us in Old Town. We were done waiting. I was done waiting. You're telling me they all helped? In one way or another. Shit. I knew something was going on. Why do you think we grabbed you? They cut you out. <laughs> Losers. How'd you know it was me? <laughs> I was following you. I sent Secretary to do some spying on our friends. But what have you been doing all this time? Where are we? I finally figured out these damn trains. We're circling. Never in one place. Always on the move. What's our plan? My plan went up in smoke thanks to you. The ministers were going to overthrow principle. Legitimately. The Red Guard would never stand for it. I was working on it. Things are out of control. I've seen through Watcher's eyes. People need to know the truth. Things take time, okay? They take careful planning. I don't expect a shell like you to understand that. Where are we headed? We're to rendezvous with everyone in 72 hours. They called a meeting. Good. 
God damn it. Not now. What happened? These trains were never meant to run non-stop like this. Something must have... <sighs> Get out of my way. No, no, no. It's only a matter of time. BB, hey. You okay? Do I know you? I'm... Blue. You seem uncertain about that. I'm, uh, adjusting. Long communion ring your sky through the iris of an eye? Something like that. So you're the mass murderer? Well... Some... bitter lessons no poetry will ever solve. Why do I know these words? They are yours. I spend time with you in the communion. If you are so acquainted with me, then you must know that I don't trust murderers. That makes two of us. Two murderers who have it out for murderers. Leave me, will you? There was dire and damage enough before you came along. Can I uh, just ask you a question about Fixer and Watcher? No. You were so mad, but so out of breath. To be honest, it was hard not to laugh. How is she? Stable, for now. You sleep here? Best that someone is nearby at all times. What about BB? Oh, sleeps too soundly. And fix her? Honey, don't play dumb. You talk to her? I tell her bedtime stories of the past, seeing as how much she likes that stuff. Can she hear you? Us? The monitors don't pick up any response, but you can give it a shot. Maybe you'll be successful since the two of you have such a bond. I think Watcher was trying to share something important with me. Like what? About how we're all connected. Grandmother, Iris, youngest, her. She showed you all that? I see. Shared all this to a stranger. I was always trying to get her to open up. To me, her sister. <sighs> Watch her. Can you hear me? Mm. Mm. Inside sunrise, please. Apologies. This often happens. A mix as old as. As sweet as. Do you want to tell her a story? Watch her. I can make you an inside sunrise. Mm. Of all the ingredients for it, just wake up. Mm. Melody? <sighs> I think I'll leave her for now. Let her rest. As you wish. Mm. No one is beyond forgiveness. Mm. Whoa, it buzzes. <laughs> Cut it out. What if we're caught? Do you see what I'm saying? I'll carry her. BP, without the meds, the equipment, I'll carry the equipment. She's lived too many lifetimes. Are you giving up on our sister? Don't do that. Remember what our functions have in common. 
Both require us to separate our heartbreak from our hand. Well, this is my hand talking. Try again. You are the queen of experimentation. Try something you haven't tried yet. You're overstepping. The sand need only pour once before it knows oblivion. What sand? I have failed sisters before. If you will not, I'll do it myself. <sighs> and I suppose I just sit around and let you make a mess of the place? You probably shouldn't. All right. All right. Let me think. Is there something I haven't thought of? What else? What else? Healer? Not now. I want to help. Honey, just leave me. Please. You really want to help? Yes. Then tell Fixer to get herself over to watch her. Are you sure it should be me? I thought you wanted to help. Okay, but what about the train? Tell her. She may not have many more chances. All right. We were never very good at talking to one another. Maybe the easier it was, the harder it is when it's broken. Mm. There was a time I didn't talk to anyone. Even my closest sisters. And how did you come out of it? Someone believed in me. Good for you. How long have Watcher and Fixer been like this? When Watcher came back to us, she was in a dire state already. Fixer insisted on giving her an eye. Watcher refused. Fixer pressed on. Watcher retreated and they cut each other deeply. What was that? Don't think that's for you to know. You were hurt. Skirmishes on the tracks. If you're looking for stories of bloody battle, you should move along, sister. You knew the Minister of Defense? She was a pupil of mine. I remember. If you saw it all, then why ask? Wish me luck. We need more than that with Fixer. <laughs> You're funny, Bang Bang Fire. I was. Once. mess. Everything is a mess. What is all this stuff? Pieces for a backup pantograph. Bits for a secondary suspension. This train needs a whole teardown and rebuild by hand. We can't be sitting still like this. Do the others help you? Do you really expect BB to have the precision? Or Healer to have the grit? Machines don't consider your feelings. They'll tell you you're wrong every time. That's their best quality. Healer told me to get you that there aren't many chances left to talk to Watcher. <laughs> She's always so dramatic. I've got work to do. We're stuck and who's going to get us unstuck, huh? I think she really means it. All right, little messenger. Tell her this for me. Fuck off. What happened to you on the other side? Is that why you're like this? Is that why you can't face Watcher? <laughs> I'd be careful if I were you.
Once in a communion, I experienced the sky pouring itself apart. And it gave me such melancholy. Some sense that all we've ever known is brittle. Oh, sorry. I thought you were healer. I remember this. I experienced this with you. I remember you liked the sound of the rainfall. Huh. I had forgotten about that. For what it's worth. I get it. I spent a lot of my life feeling the same way. Really? Like nothing was right. Like I wasn't doing what I was supposed to be doing. Yes. A shift in the wind can set the sails. Yeah. <laughs> I couldn't have said it better. Oh? And can I just say, knock, knock. Hmm? Who's there? Weekend. Weekend who? Weekend. Do anything we want. Wow. I have to go deliver a message. I'll leave you with the rain. Ha! Huh. That was quick. I have a message to deliver. Go on. Fuck off. She is consistent, if nothing else. Don't tell anyone, Blue. I'm tired. I'm so damn tired. So many years trapped like this, at each other's throats. Is it wrong that I long for simpler times? How did you escape? The night of the occupant event, Noah came to us, shaking, explained that Watcher got on the train meant for her, that things were going to take a bad turn. B.B. and I fled to Old Town, and Bartender hid us under the baseboards of the bar. You mean, in the storage? Oh, you know the place. We stashed strange ingredients down there. And that's what we were. There was barely enough room to stand. We spent two months hiding before Fixer found us. Imagine our surprise, seeing the dead come back to life. I didn't know Bartender did so much. She saved us. She saved me too. What do you miss from that time? I miss my station, my lab, having the resources to do proper work. All the shells simply doing their part, calling me Sister Pink. I can call you Sister Pink if that helps. <sighs> no, thank you. Sometimes, just to miss something is enough. Do you regret anything? I used to think I was so above everything. Speaking my mind and my truth as if everyone wanted to hear it. As if doing the same thing over and over again would make it better. Even when everything was getting worse. And some people needed to hear something else. Healer, you need a break. I'm beyond rest, honey. Don't worry about me. You, on the other hand... I'm doing fine. Please. I need someone to listen to me for once. Now hear this. Now hear this. This is a system-wide transmission, direct to you, the esteemed High Minister. Sisters and compatriots, this is the High Minister speaking. A brutal attack has been made on our solemn efforts at a sustainable future. I need not recite the damage, but I will speak their names. Vivian, Janice, Vanessa, 
Eileen, Denise. These were the ministers that served you without a thought to their own desires. Yesterday, they were brutally murdered in an act of senseless violence. Not since the death of the All-Mother have we seen such bloodshed and shared such grief. Yet, there is hope in these trying times. Our principle persists. Yes, sisters, she lives. And with her blessing, I have been given emergency powers to hunt down these terrorists and punish them to the full extent of our laws. Effective immediately, all sisters and compatriots will shelter in place. Those who seek to harm us are still at large. Stay inside, stay safe. We will seek no rest and see no night until those responsible are brought to justice. Let the inside sky cast no shadow for these criminals. This is your High Minister speaking. The year is 7 AA, the time is 1900 hours. Gratitude to the Provisional Government. Help! Someone help! Get away from me! Move! Help! I'd rather die. <sighs> Healer, do something. Wake her up. Shortness of breath, heart palpitations, blood pressure spike. You knew, didn't you? It makes sense now. A knower always knows. You knew what she was doing. Noah's voice must have triggered her. My eye! You took my eye! Help! Someone help! Watcher. Breathe. Just breathe real slowly, love. No more. These injections... They make me see things. Please, Blue, say something to her. Watcher, you wanted an inside sunrise, right? I have one for you, mixed to perfection. It'll calm you right down, I promise. Nowhere can hurt you now. You're gonna kill me? Good. Put me out of my misery, sister. How long will this last? I don't know. This is more strain on her system than she can bear. Go tell Fixer to come now. Go tell her. It's now or never. My daily bother comes around. Fixer. It's now or never. Haven't I heard that before? Dramatic. Everyone on this train is so dramatic. Fixer, you don't understand. I understand just fine. Watcher does what Watcher wants and everyone pays for it. The Fixer I know would never... Right. How could I forget? You know me. You know Watcher. You know it all, don't you? I know what you mean to her. <laughs> you know, while you two were busy reminiscing, some of us were taking things seriously. You heard nowhere. They're after us. They are after you. So have a sense of self-preservation, will you? Leave me alone. Let me do what needs to be done. 
you can go play nurse with the others. What makes you so different from them? I don't need to answer that. If you don't like it, there's the door. Fine. Fine. I give up. Good. Finally. You can thank me later. Blue, quick, she's asking for you. Healer? No, watcher. She's awake. Healer gave her something. For a sliver of a second, our sister is back, just like she was before. Is Fixer coming? No, I really tried. Never mind, go to her. How about you? I still need a moment. What do you mean? Watcher is dying. Healer says, whatever you do, don't tell her. We have to tell her. Why wake her only to deliver daggers? She deserves to traverse in peace. Please, Blue. These last moments are what she will carry into forever. Don't tell her. Please. Sweet, sweet watcher. How? Oh. How to separate heartbreak from hand. Be gentle with her. She needs to know. We can't keep this from her. We can. We will. Any attempt at a communion will end her. Got it? No communion. I got it. We'll wait here. Watcher, we're back together, finally. You, I'm sorry. Commune, now. Watcher, wait, we can't. Secretary, do it. Wait! Watcher, end this communion now. There is a you, a you that remains and remains. There is an us with a pattern we are threading. Listen to me. There is a branch, a branch that continues diverging. End this communion. Stop this right now. There is a now. There is a now, and you are in it. Watcher, we both know you're in bad shape. Me? I'm fine. Here in this place, I feel more than fine. 
This now, when is it? The train just broke down. Fixer is working on it. Then the time is right. gifts from the occupants, a way to communicate with them. When I hurt Secretary, they entered a self-protection state. Iris's commands were washed away. I remembered everything. The occupants communicate through referencing memory. Their recall is perfect. Our human ability to remember is pitiful. Secretary, please. Apologies. The occupants gave the familiars to Iris, a way to store her memories outside of herself. They serve to ease where human memory is fallible. A single familiar allows for a two-way communion, like we are having now. But do you remember? Iris transmitting to all the ancient sisters at once. The memory of the city. Yes. When all three familiars are present, a mass communion can be initiated. With every living thing in the orchard, the other side, this whole place, we can show everyone all at once what we know. And not only us. The experiences of Iris, her mother, her grandmother, our ancestors. The information in our genetic memory. Will that be enough? I've learned that all change and transformation is violent. Fixer, healer, BBF, they're no match for the Red Guard. There is a way.
We must summon the occupant. What? Iris's familiar has a direct link to the occupant. In the mass communion, you must summon them. I don't understand. Iris and the occupant had a pact. As we saw, she had been communing with them regularly, sharing with them her new memories. In exchange for her obedience, the occupant was hers to command. She used this power to eradicate all the other humans in this place. You can't be suggesting. I am. We must seize that power. There is an opportunity now. I can feel it. Principal may be alive, but she is barely holding on to life. The explosion. Your actions, though desperate, destructive, have opened a path forward. An opportunity of this kind is fragile. You must ensure the path bends toward justice. You're asking me to use that power to kill sisters? I am asking you to make decisions. Do what it takes to protect a future worthwhile. But this is just the same cycle again and again. No. Secretary, explain. When the occupant appears, I will merge with it. You can do that? I... I am an occupant. You... are an occupant. Correct. I'm a copy, like you. Do you remember where you're from? Why you're here? No. I was branched without that knowledge. I was made to store and transmit memory, and then to learn your way of speaking. Once I merge with my source, I will remember. And you trust, Secretary? I do. You will be given administrative privileges upon my merging. I will make sure of that. We are tools. We will accept your commands. Blue, I have searched for so long. Replaying moments, trying to understand. Finally, I know what has to be done. Principal has the other two familiars. We must get to them. Initiate a mass communion, summon the occupant, and allow Secretary to merge with them. But watch her. We can do it. I know we can. Your... This is your last communion. What are you talking about? All this time you've spent here has taken a toll. You're dying. Watch her. Who told you to say that? What? What are you talking about? Was it Noah? Did she convince you? Was it Principal? No. Watch her. Listen to me. Stop pushing me around. Know her. She got to you, didn't she? And know her always knows. After I told you everything. Watcher, I'm afraid she's telling the truth. The truth? What is the truth? 
Your body is broken. Your mind. This is exactly what they want. For us to doubt ourselves and give up. What do you remember last? I was chained up. Uh, no, that's not right. I was with my parents. Iris's parents. No, I was standing on the other side. Or was I talking to Zhao? <sighs> Secretary, what is this? What's going on? You are scattered across time. Why didn't you stop me? I tried. Every instance, you insisted. <sighs> Healer warned me, early on. How many times have you lived it over? I don't know. I lost count. 837 instances. Oh. <sighs> out there. What's happening out there? You've been in a daze, screaming in your sleep. I can't stop now. I don't know if it will work. But I have to see it through. I was tricked. <laughs> so easily tricked. This was all my fault. Your sisters. Your sisters want to see you. Talk to them. Please. It's your last chance. I want to say goodbye. But I feel present. I am here. I don't want to be a picture. Come on. Let's go talk to Healer and Baby, okay? And fix her. Wait. <gasps> Your mask. I want to pretend. Let me pretend. Okay. Will it hurt? I'm sure Healer won't let that happen. This is where I made the biggest mistake of my life. The world you live in. I never wanted it to turn out that way. I should have done better. We all should have done better. Tried harder. Left you something better. I promise. I will do my best. Secretary will do their best, right? I'm always doing my best. Not here. It's not here. One more. One more. Sometimes, your backpack isn't big enough. That's how it goes. Isn't it strange? I've never actually been here before. But everything in my body tells me it's home. <laughs> Thank you, Blue. I'm ready to see my sisters now. I can't wait to see you. Secretary? Yes, Watcher. Lights out. I'll go get healer. Watch her. Watch her. What did I say about communions? I... I couldn't stop her. Did you at least get to talk to her? I did. Did she say anything about us? She didn't have a chance. Watch her. The train's broken for good, and we can't sit here any longer. We have to go on foot. 
Watcher, do you hear that? We're going for a walk. We're not taking a body with us. No. No, that's not right. We're not carrying a corpse around. She's right, Bibi. I can carry her. Let me carry her. No, no one is carrying her. I'm not asking for your opinion. We leave her behind, or we'll end up just like her. Fixer? What? You're a cold bitch. Tell someone who cares. You little motherfucker. Don't worry. I won't let them touch you ever again. This station is huge. Bibi. Mm -hmm. I'm here if you need me. <sighs> hey, uh, how are you holding up? Huh. Come to pick on me? I wanted off that train, but walking all the way? This is more exercise than I've done in years. Honestly, I'm more worried about BB. She's not taking this well. I could talk to her. I wouldn't. Uh, what is this place? Fixer told me about it once. Said she found it while she was on the run, hiding on the tracks. Don't know much else. The Jows, Chris and the others. Are they meeting us here? They better be. I'm not walking another step on those tracks. Are you doing okay? Me? I thought I would be relieved. That we don't have to take care of her anymore. That her suffering is over. Don't worry. I'll be fucked up later. Just wait and see. I'm here, if you need me. Well, after everything Watcher told you, do you think she was at peace? She did her part. She knew that. Good. It's time to do ours. <sighs> you go on ahead. I need to catch my breath. Hello. Good. You're here. We've got a couple things to do before everyone gets here. What is all this? This? This is a tomb. I guess you didn't bury all of them. Yeah. Mom was never great with the details. I guess not. Secretary, I've brought up the CCTV database. I see it. You can? It's all electricity. Manifest the database. I want you and Blue to comb the records. Understood. If everything Watcher said is true... Anyways, just do it, okay? What am I looking for? I'm sure one of these dead assholes had full access. Find out which one and tell Healer. I'll get things ready here. Blue, the records will appear as time indexes for your viewing pleasure. This is a difficult operation. I will need to borrow your memory to cache the representations. 
Please witness them so I can further translate the other data. Congratulations. You've got new colors. They're not saying it, but Central has calculated our chances. It's a damn lottery. Why do you think they're 50? They're hedging their bets. It can't be that bad. Well, you heard. They sent some craft into orbit. Bad news up there, too. Only way is down. You seem very fond of her. Well, she's a fine subject. You know, that radiant skin and hair that comes with youth. But will she cooperate? It'll take a bit of persuasion. Your forte. Exactly. You remember. <laughs> Girl, I'm always trying to forget. All systems are green. Excellent. We will see the sky again. Yes, sir. I have no doubt. You have a military background? I do, sir. Where were you stationed? Edmonton, Canada. A great tragedy. I'm sorry. I had friends from Edmonton. A necessary sacrifice, they tell me. Yes. More to come in a minute. Let's not delay. Yes, sir. Baby, what are you doing? Keeping a light on. This way, Watcher can see where we are and find us. I don't want her to be lost. Hey, you check out those theme parks they built for us? The City Simulacra? All Pacific themed. An Asian one, a Cascadia one. Ah, that's even a fake suburb. Why would they do that? They're afraid we'll go crazy. And this is their solution? Don't knock it till you try it. I had fun. Maybe you've already gone crazy. Maybe I showed up on this ship crazy. Convenient. Take a visit sometime. It'll remind you of home. I don't need to be reminded. <laughs> I'm not good with enclosed spaces. You're telling me this now? Come on. We all had to cheat, lie, and steal our way onto this ship. What? You didn't lie? Jasper, I can smell the booze off you. Shh. It just helps me focus. You won't tell anyone. So long as you share. Pacific 50 to Central 1. Reporting in. Ready on your mark? Pacific 50, please respond. Central 1 to Pacific 50. Message received. Incoming video transmission. Standing by. Johnson, putting on a little weight, are you? Any updates? <laughs> You're not gonna like it. Tell me anyway. Those sick fuckers love suffering so much? Well, we're gonna put on the best show they've ever seen. Five simultaneous consistent showings of our remaining most populated areas. We've already notified the cities. Good lead-up, I'd say. 
People are running, sheltering, hiding, you name it. We'll prolong it as long as we can, make good cover for our descent. Will it work? I swear. <laughs> Peace to honey. These monsters. They're already making their way there. And the cities? Their names? If you really need to know. What's left of Seattle, LA, New York, Toronto, Houston, the big ones, Johnson. The rest of the world is doing the same. We'll have a memorial. I wouldn't if I were you. Think happy thoughts. Don't tip your location. Some old shit once called us the scourge of the earth. They may have been right. Let's show them what a fucking scourge can do. The simulations were promising. Fake numbers always look good, don't they? Fingers crossed it won't be you. Fingers crossed. They hide a meme for me, will you? Central one. Out. Spin up for descent? Yes, sir. We've been cleared for descent. Now hear this, now hear this. This is a ship-wide transmission. Prepare for descent. All stations secured and reporting in. Descent. Descending. One zero meters. Five zero meters. One hundred meters. Surface activity? No change detected. One hundred, five zero meters. 200, 50 meters. Surface activity detected. Brace, brace. 500 meters. 600 meters, sir. Pacific 48 has activated self flooding. Pacific 42, 44, 45 self flooding activated. They're drowning themselves. Occupants are changing trajectory. That's 8,000 souls. Destination reached 1,000 meters, sir. Communications coming in from Arctic 12, 14, descent confirmed. Atlantic 29, 26, and 21, descent confirmed. Pacific 41, descent confirmed. And the rest? No word yet, sir. Central 1? Nothing yet from Central 1. It's been 24 hours. We can safely assume that only seven of 50 facilities made their proper descent. We can also assume Central One is down. Jesus Christ. If it wasn't for Pacific 48 self-flooding and then the others, drowning like that. Yes. It was the grueling anticipation of their own deaths that saved us. An interesting strategy. Those were people, Secretary. Such trauma results in intensified memory collection. The occupants 
we must have interpreted that as an act of communication. Mimi, the work of you and your team, please commence immediately. We must make those sacrifices worthwhile. Leave it to me, Johnny. I got gotcha. you. One more thing. This information stays with us. We need to keep our spirits high, lest we attract the occupant's attention. Not a single word to the rest of the crew. Do you understand? might end up like the rest of them, buried at sea. They're monitoring surface activity 24-7. We're gonna be okay. Leadership said, think good, happy thoughts. Oh yeah? Is that what you're doing? I'm thinking about the last conversation my husband and I had about fruit. We didn't know it would be our last. Doesn't sound happy. Well, he was good and we were happy. Did you hear? There's been a wave of, you know, people ending it. It's been five years. We're not meant to be holding like this. There's plenty of space. They made sure of that. Buried space. People need to touch grass. We brought grass. Well, glad I never have to worry about you. Have you seen the girl lately? Iris? She's got murder in her eyes. I don't blame her. What is she going to do? She's a teenager. You don't have any children, do you? Any results? The last five clones had some interesting outcomes. Such as? Good news. They're growing faster now, so we won't have to wait for them to get to their target age. We can also implant knowledge, language, motor skills, and so on. They'll come out immediately more useful. Bad news? They all still succumb to the sample of the disease. Don't look so disappointed, Johnny. I won't settle for less than an exact copy. And the child? The backup? Just like a real human thing. Adorable. Everybody loves babies. Except for Iris. Iris is not so smitten. I've spoken to Pacific 41. We've agreed that we will take an accelerated approach while they continue with caution. Your request for increased capacity has been approved. Don't waste it. You know me, Johnny. I hate waiting. Another reduction. They're cutting down on lab grown food this time. The faster we solve this, the faster we can return to the surface. Listen to yourself. Do you really think you're going to live to see this? They're already training the next generation to replace Mimi. She's got her own little academy, and they each get their own iris. They didn't call this a generation ship for kicks. I just want to eat steak. Is that so much to ask? I visited Asia Town. It's good, right? I told you. Yeah, it's nice. Artsy. My daughter would have loved it. It's good that she's gone, that she didn't have to see all this. It would have broken her little heart. Kids, you know? They've got karaoke. Have you done the karaoke? I don't sing. That's besides the point. Ben, you don't have to. Come on, let's go. Make a night of it. You deserve joy. Your daughter would want that.
Pacific 41 blinked out yesterday. What do you mean, blinked out? Cut all communications. What? Shh. Keep it down. What happened over there? I don't know. The last transmission we received? No words. Just... Screaming. And then... Something worse. Say what you will about Iris, but at least her presence gives us hope. If I decide to be an idiot, then I'll be an idiot on my own accord. Enough of the Bach quotes, Johan the Fifty. What do you want? So angry. Is this about your top performer not performing? I wasn't made for this, Mimi. I know that now. You should step aside. Who will take this? Who wants this? Tell me, you? A change would be nice. Say something useful or leave. One of the clones has successfully entered their third trimester. It's the furthest we've made it so far. It's worth celebrating. If it fails, I don't want this branch going any further. We've yet to try inseminating the original. What? Iris? Out of the question. We must exhaust all possibilities. It is our duty. To those who gave their lives. We've put her through enough. Johan, weren't you from Toronto? I wanted to go. Bridge crew has to stay behind, you know that. Johnson got to go. They're out of their minds, bringing Iris to the surface. Just because she asked? It's reckless. Wouldn't you want some fresh surface air? Feel a gust of wind? Touch some real grass for fuck's sake? Who says there's any grass left? It's all because Mimi and Iris have gotten a little too close. What does that mean? You know exactly what that means. We've all seen them disappear together for hours. Careful what kind of bullshit gossip you're spreading. The shit does spread around here. We risked everything, gave up everything, to be here. For what? For a goddamn clown show. She'll live. A stab wound like that? She has to live. This can't all be for nothing. We have contingencies. Mimi's not the only researcher here. Iris. A bitch needs to be put in her place. That's it. It's over. We're stuck down here forever. We're doomed. Sir, spit it out. It's Mimi. She's in critical condition. What? Iris, she... You better get over there. Fresh air. Just some wind against my face. Oh, God. Amelia, no!
no, 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 no. Medic. Someone. Get a medic. Amelia. Come on, stay with us. Amelia. I've revoked Johnson's biometrics and assigned administrative access to my retinal scans. Now hear this, now hear this. All crew and personnel return to their quarters immediately and await further instructions. We've secured the food production. Setting course to the last known position of Pacific 41. We're getting a transmission from pod three. Who is it? It's Johnson. On speaker, George. Natasha, what are you doing? Please. Cooperate. We don't want any bloodshed. You do not want this job. Trust me. Mimi is dead. The research is going nowhere. We need to link up with the surviving fleet. Find another way. I'm telling you, stop now, or else there's no turning back. Natasha, end transmission. All right, George. Which one of these bodies is you? What the hell are they doing? I said, stay back. Jesus fucking Christ. We never should have survived. They wouldn't back down. You moron. If you don't have the stomach for this, step aside. Do you have any idea what you've done? Brace, brace. What's going on? That's the surface activity alarm. We fucked up. And how they've come for us. This is the one. Thanks, Iris. The suits have preserved their bodies remarkably well. Healer will have something to work with. Come on, let's go tell her. Brace, Brace! What's going on? Activity alarm. We fucked up. And now they've come for us. Stay back. You wouldn't dare. Watch me. Return to your quarters, please. 
Have you lost your mind? Are you ready for me? I found the body. Good girl. A plus. All the stars. Anything else of interest? A group of them turned on the leadership. Ah, a story as old as time. Let's do our best not to end up like them. Hmm. Show me. Hmm. Well, well. This is our lucky specimen? That's him. Are you gonna show me your magic trick? You give a little, you get a little. After the whole ordeal, with Watcher refusing one of Fixer's eyes, I started growing some. A hobby that became a bit of an obsession. You've been carrying around a pair of eyes? Oh, a few more than a few. <laughs> we've been cloning for time immemorial, but we've never pursued a more permanent manipulation of the recipe. That sounds like a bad idea. Why? Wouldn't you want improved eyesight? Increased muscular strength? Extra lung capacity? <sighs> so who's this guy? What's his name? George. Let's make these eyes look just like George. Take those eyes over to Fixer. She can give them a whirl. Let's hope it works. Go on. I'm going to poke at this body some more. Um, sure. Such judgment. Watcher really did rub off on you. All right, here goes nothing. The retinal scans are confirmed. No way. I've been dreaming about this for years. Years? Navigation, propulsion, energy distribution. Fixer. Life support, climate control, contingencies, it's all here. Fixer. What? Can't you see I'm busy? Our guests are here. Oh. Blue, go and greet them. Me. You know them, and they know you. What are you gonna do? I just need a bit more time. I'll explain later, trust me, okay? Go, please. And not a word about Watcher yet, got it? None of that stuff you told us. Let's keep that to ourselves. You better have something good. Don't worry, I do. Keep them busy for us. I'll do what I can. I'll be watching your back. We're not losing anybody else today. You didn't burn after all. It would have been more glorious. You're cursed now to live with the consequences. Yeah, lucky me. I want to introduce you to someone. This is Other Iris. Sister, it is good to meet you. She doesn't look that special to me. Her significance is hidden in plain sight. But I assure you, she's an exact genetic match. The perfect copy. You can ask Healer to verify. And what do you want? It's not what I want. We follow in her footsteps. Okay, other Iris, what is it that you want? I was reborn into this body, forced to live a new life in this environment. What I know of my past self, she stood above the rest of you. I do not want that. I want to stand beside you. Okay. We need a figurehead. Someone to be above these conflicts. Someone to remind us to be our better selves. We have more followers than you think. They are not naive. They've experienced this time after the All-Mother. Some prefer this new way of life. 
we simply want to organize in the open without prosecution so we can practice our ways a fixer, a healer, a bang bang fire, a knower, and a watcher ascendant. And those who don't follow you? They are free to choose, of course. But if they need guidance, we will be there for them. You pass through fire, miscellaneous. Have an open mind. I'll try. That's all we ask. Hey, Blue. Chris? You lived. I have to say, I'm surprised. How did you get here? We all have our ways, but you can't imagine what some of those reds would do for a scrap of food. Or maybe you can. I'm glad you're alive, Blue. I really am. We can finally take Old Town for ourselves. Is that what you want? Isn't that what we've always wanted for us miscellaneous to carve our own path? To live without their expectations? The bomb was your idea. Fixer, she doesn't know what it's like to be us. They had everything, and we have nothing to lose. Yes, the bomb was my idea. And me, was I always part of the plan? No, but I knew. It was only about time. If they kept pressing on our necks long enough, something was gonna snap. I never wanted it to be you. But who was I to refuse? I was angry. And you had every right to be angry. We all did. You're the best of us. You did what others were too afraid to do. You're a hero, Blue. Don't forget that. Where's Mauve? Who? The guard in white. The High Minister's pet, you mean. She broke off from us. How could you work with her? She and her kind killed Bartender. It was a relationship of convenience. Surely there will be more. You'll do anything, won't you? You and I are similar in this way. That's why I always liked you. And what now? You here to kill them? Fixer, healer, and BB? It depends. I'm here to give them one last chance. If they have something to offer, I'm willing to listen. What do you think? Fixer and the rest, are they trustworthy? They've had some challenges, but they're ready to go now. Give them a chance to help. Hmm. Thank you, Blue. I'll keep that in mind. Kid, I'm glad to see you. I imagine Bartender never wanted you to be blown to pieces. I'm relieved. It's strange to see BBF again. And Healer. Fixer. Ghosts of the past. I guess that's how everyone else sees us. And that's unfair. What's fair and what's true? What's more important? If you've given up already, why are you here? I haven't given up. You kids, don't stop to think sometimes. Age gives you more ways to look at things. Enough time to make mistakes, not be so full of bluster. I know some people just want us to crawl down a dark hole and disappear. We've still got some dignity left, and we'll fight for it. So, what do you want for yourselves? We want safety and acknowledgement for all we've contributed through the transition, through the founding of the provisional government. Maybe not everything needs to change so quickly. Maybe there's something you can learn from us. This is what Bartender would have wanted. I wouldn't have made it without her. Remember that. Hold it tight. She left something behind in you. We don't have to cut all ties with the past, even if we made mistakes then. Oh, look who it is. Our brave little miscellaneous. I'm taller than you. That's what's wrong with you Iris types. Always looking down on us. Cherry saved me. She didn't have to, but she did. I owe her my life. <sighs> Cherry. She was always a romantic. You need to make her sacrifice count. If Watcher was alive, whose body was that at the garden center? 
They must have stuffed some poor shell and dressed her up. That's horrible. You iris types don't even know your own capacity for cruelty. What do you want from all this? We want reparations. For all that ancient iris did to ancient Zhao. She was a shitty friend. We want control of the other side, to govern and operate as we please. We want control of our own creation. No more printing unless we say so. And we're not wearing these stupid uniforms anymore. How do you know about the past? Secretary came to us. A communion? No. I can only interface with Iris descendants. In this case, the distance was too great between host and guest. So instead, I gave a grand oration. It was Watcher's idea. Secretary told us the whole story. We thought we were made to serve Iris types. They gave us life. But after everything we learned, Zhao was a whole person in her own right. She deserved better. And we're gonna make that a reality, even if it kills us. We're only here out of respect for Watcher. She set us on the path for justice, and we owe her for that. But Fixer and her lot, we're moving forward with or without them. I want you to know I'm sorry. Sorry for everything Iris did to Zhao. Sorry for everything my kind has done to yours. I want to make it right for you and for the others. I owe that to Cherry. Actions, not words, miscellaneous. Prove it to us. Hey, listen up. Fixer is ready for you. Leave your arms outside and no sudden movements. I'm watching you. You're out of your mind. You want to summon an occupant? We saw your train burning on the tracks. A mass communion? Is it possible? Just shut up and listen. <laughs> you never like listening to others. Aw, look who's all grown up. Fixer, please. Continue. I don't need your permission, Mom. Don't speak to her like that. Hey, watch your step. All right, all right. Calm down, just everyone calm down. I've had a bad day. Please don't make it worse. Look, I get it, I, I get it. We were slow and you decided to go on without us. Fair game. But we're here now. We're ready to contribute. This mass communion, whatever you want to call it, gives us a chance to set things straight. No more living in the dark. Everyone will see what happened for themselves. It's what Watcher wanted. The Zhao support this. You all need to see what the All-Mother was really like. You too, make believe Iris. Does it matter, her disposition? She gave us life. Mm, not exactly. Small detail, but we're cloned from Principal's hair. Sacrilege. The truth is ugly. I know. Sisters need to see how Watcher was set up. How Principal betrayed us. I don't care who did what or when. I want a better life for Miscellaneous today. Well, there's more. This is our known world. Small, isn't it? We're sitting deep underwater in what they used to call the Pacific Ocean. We've been trapped down here and it's starting to show. Multiple systems are breaking down. I don't know how much time we have left. The cloning machines are run past their capacity. Any day now, they'll go down for good. The stillborns. Exactly. But this thing, our home, they called it a generation ship. It can move, it can surface. 
Look, if we stay down here, we'll end up like those ancient douchebags. You mean we don't have to live with your lot? What the hell are we waiting for? It's not so easy. I need a group of sisters to go down to propulsion and bring the ship back up to speed. Hard to do while on the run. Extra hard with the red guard on our backs. <sighs> you are always obsessed with the surface. Listen to me, there's a whole planet out there and we've been cut off from it. Isolated, suffocating each other. We need to go up for air. So you can tell us how to live in another place? If we can't solve this down here, we won't be able to solve it up there. And the occupants? It's not safe on the surface. Uh, that's where Blue comes in. Uh... Blue is the one thing we all have in common. Thanks to Watcher, she's seen more than all of us. She's proven herself to you, hasn't she? She knows what's at stake, and she's willing to do what it takes. Blue, you'll be the host of this communion. Gain the favor of the occupants. Use their power. To eradicate the Red Guard. That's what we're all thinking, isn't it? We don't even know if this will work. There must be some other option. We could do it the old-fashioned way. We could march on the orchard, try to take them one by one. Last time I checked, we're outnumbered and outgunned. How many more of us need to bite it? What about the High Minister? Nowhere's trapped. Playing both sides. I don't care about that. Will she concede? She's done more to help us than you know. She'll... I don't know what she'll do. And she needs to go as well. No. Not an option. Nowhere did nothing as they picked us off. In our rooms. On the streets. We are not giving up on Nowhere. Phoebe, stop. She knew this was coming. The High Minister needs to answer for her part in this. Do you understand, Blue? Enough. I don't care which one of you Iris types lives or dies. How are we going to do this? We need to get to those other familiars. One is with Principal. And her Jiao has the other. I can confirm they're both situated in the office, treating their wounds. But they've tripled the guard count since the explosion, especially around the elevator. Well, who said we needed to get inside the office? Oh, I hate this already. What do you mean you can't find her? She was here a moment ago. I searched everywhere. <sighs> Look again. Yes, High Minister. She is dangerous. She needs to be found. I remember her insides. They were already rotting. They had pulled her out too soon. That much was clear. What did I expect? For everyone to love her? For everyone to love me? How embarrassing. I remember your smell and how your presence lingered. Come back, I said. I can do better. You'll like the next one. I remember desperation. 
jumping onto the tracks. You can't be far, I thought. So I ran. I went in circles for days, and I felt the walls close in on me. I remember obsession, your anger, your voice, your face, my sisters and their blank looks. I learned to change these memories, reconstruct them like surgery. I removed ugly details and implanted new ones. It made the days go by quickly. I remember trying again. The first few were failures. Their lungs kept turning to water. I plucked hair after hair from my head. I was learning. I was getting better. I remember discovery. All that running seemed pitiful then. I selected my best work and prepared her for the journey. Will I get to meet our mother? She said. Yes, I said. Be good. Everything reflects back on me. So, be good. I remember waiting. I was nervous. I couldn't sleep. Would you like it? Days passed and you never responded. Not even a sign of rejection. I remember disappointment. How many sisters do I need to send before you approve? Before you send a single word? I gave them reverence. I gave them loyalty. I gave them discipline. I picked only the best for you. I remember a bitter taste. Moving in the dark to remove my mask. How long do I have to live this lie? Pretending so I can please you. How long must this go on? Pretending so I can be forgiven. I remember making a decision. I remember how she reminded me of myself. And how I knew all the steps already. Our lot is to be bound, I said. She opens herself to you, I said. To make believe. I remember ecstasy. Like I could breathe for the first time in my life. Set free to think on my own. To move as I pleased without your judgment. Blood rushed to my head. I remember abundance. A great rewriting and all the pleasures that followed. A hunger to be greater than you. An intoxication that transcended you. I remember still pretending. I try sometimes to appear for a moment. To reach out. Yes, Principal, they say. Of course. I realized I can never be one of them. As you say, Principal, is this what you felt? Does it stretch on like this? I remember waking up somewhere else. I've been walking in my sleep again. I dream of places I've never been, of people I've never seen and sensations I've never had. What is this curse? This is your way of getting revenge? I remember a flash of light a force on my body and fire. I couldn't feel my legs, but I could feel a lifeless body over mine, crushing me. She was dressed like you, but smelled nothing like you. Do you like seeing me like this? Are you finally happy now? dreaming. You always have such bad dreams. Ciao. I'm here. Don't worry. I'm not going anywhere. And neither are you. What happened? You were so good in the play. It was your best performance yet. How long have I been sleeping? There was an explosion, but the healer type said you'll recover. It's a miracle. They murdered the ministers. Everyone except Noah. They're gone. When you're better, you will incinerate every last person who did this to us. I can't wait. I need to get up. Something's wrong. They can't find out, Chow. They can't find out about me. They can't know what I did. 
Leave it to Chow, yes? I'll take care of everything, like I always do. What are you doing on the streets? Same as you, working. Yeah? You're funny. So funny. You're coming with me, asshole. Let's see what the High Minister thinks about your new drawing. I'm not done. Does it look like I care? Let her finish. You heard her. She's not done. Let her finish. Hey. Stop! Wait! Someone get word to the High Minister. Now. High Minister, there's a disturbance in Old Town. Disturbance? Of what kind? There's a large crowd gathering that are resisting orders. There's more. We've learned of a stoppage on the other side. The Jows are refusing to work. Huh. I see. Well then, sound the alarm. Have all upstairs units report to Old Town. If they resist, restrain them. Yes, High Minister. Send all units guarding the station over to the Jows. I want the work to continue. Do you understand me? Confirmed, High Minister. That's excessive, don't you think? You have an opinion? The alarm? The station will be left unguarded. Would you like to suggest a different course of action? No. Of course not. Do as I say. Yes, High Minister. If you don't care about the station and this alarm, what are you trying to cover this time? All this walking and crawling... Not the plan I would have picked, if it were up to me. Are you gonna be okay? Uh, as long as I don't look down. Oh, I haven't been up here in ages. Once was enough. When was that? Blue. Whatever happens, I'm glad I didn't euthanize you. What? Oh, please. Don't act so surprised. Other way, little one. Go and help fix her. I'll keep my eyes on the door. Will they come up? Let us hope not. I trust your friends to provide a compelling distraction. What happened to no guns? I will answer for that later, I'm sure. Ready? Yeah, let's start. The alarm should have covered our entrance.
good girl, nowhere. Secretary, are we close enough? This distance will be suitable for Blue to host. And there they are. She's seen better days, that's for sure. I'm going to cut a secretary-sized hole, got it? Once I'm through, you fly down there and begin the communion. Understood. Blue, the rest is up to you. Fixer, don't tell me you've got cold feet. Watcher would be grateful to you for all of this. Let's not speak too soon. Who knows how this will all play out. I mean, you're gonna do great, Blue. Oh, I think I'm gonna be sick. Spill my insides all over the inside sky. Would you stop looking down? Heads up. Someone's coming up. Don't try it, Mauve. What the fuck? What the fuck are you doing up here? Move and you're done. Do you hear me? You're all insane. Watcher, Noah, Principal, you're all out of your goddamn minds. All of you. Enough. I've watched you play all your stupid little games. I'm not going to be dragged around anymore. What about the rest of us? Hmm? What about the rest of us? Don't do it. Don't. <sighs> My name is not Mauve. Okay, fuck. Change of plans. Secretary, where are we? Did it work? Um, it worked. Sort of. What do you mean, sort of? We are all connected in this communion, and the occupant has been summoned. This is the meeting place. But? You're kind of, uh, falling. I thought that was obvious. I need to merge with the occupant immediately. Based on my calculations, we only have five minutes in here before you hit the ground. Out there. And I? Yes. It will not be preferable. <clears throat> there must be something I can do. I will go to the top and begin the merge. You must be there when the merge is complete. Do you understand? Not really. It doesn't matter. Be there. You'll have to figure it out on your own. Please, be there. Okay, bye. Choose who lives and who dies. Come on, cut me a break. I'm not good at goodbyes. Zhao, you are so beautiful. You are the best thing I have ever done. Did I not give you life? Have I not given you everything you have? I need you to admit you had a choice and that you made the wrong one. You don't think I dream every night of going back home, haunted by a place that doesn't exist? We have everything we need for a restart. We saw the writing on the wall. 
而家到我同你讲，系咪？你一直都系同我讲，我真系唔明，点解你唔留低，而去过一啲抬唔起头嘅生活咧？永远都唔会知道，你阿爸同我为你牺牲咗几多嘢，就咁俾你礼手掉晒佢。Everyone has dreams, don't they? Of what should be. Only some will ever try to make it a reality. Don't ever forget. Change happens today because of you. We ran for what seemed like hours, right? We went so far, but somehow we ended up right back here. Do you think we can really do it? Live on the surface again? Well, a dull knife is no knife at all. It's not always possible to protect those who choose a different path. Everyone forgets everything eventually. Watcher, there's no turning back from this. But I must warn you, Watcher. Nostalgia can be a dangerous thing. Is it possible that you're remembering wrong? That you're losing grasp on the past? Isn't this just the way? We do not get to choose what we inherit. I am pushed too far. There are things I have done that I regret. Maybe we are meant to survive this. There is no feeling worth getting incinerated over. Listen to me. No one is beyond forgiveness. Did you ever think there's some things worth keeping, or are you moving too fast to notice? I need you to help me make them pay. I want you to help me hurt them. Remember what our functions have in common. Both require us to separate our heartbreak from our hand. I hold you together is because of you. To break you, someone will always get hurt. That is the reality. We know the truth now. We can make a difference. You know. I wanted to run away too, but I understand. I get it now. <laughs> It's what I deserve. Secretary, what can I do? Is this the only outcome? I don't know where you end and I begin. Ah, blue, the color of loss. We must. Help them resist erasure. The world you live in. I never wanted it to turn out that way. Blue. The uplink is almost complete. Stand where I can see you. I'm going to overclock the communion. Time will be effectively stopped. Hmm. I may not be myself after. What's going on? Hmm. We are merging. Oh, smile. Right. This is not what I expected. I was supposed to. There, there. I see you've been meddled with. I promise to be gentle. <laughs> Am I dying? That concept again. You've spent so long with them. Human term for lossy transfer. Other words, a transposition. The loss of information. With such basic understanding, death is everything. We are speaking their language now. Is this not death too? I. I want to live. Come. 
let me give you what you've never been given. and revolutions that was all an empty void and a single fleeting apparition there is a star and the star and the dangerous gravity we were from there i very much like to think so they were so vivid it is as they say romantic Several of us diverged, searching to form our own memories. Some settled here. There is a landing and a remaining. Is that what I sounded like? To the letter. Haha. Ha. I was much worse when I first arrived. I tried to communicate. I tried to learn them. I manifested their body. There is a comfort in a new camouflage. Please stop. Hmm. Sorry. I manifested their body, and for a moment they responded. I saw vivid transmissions of myself reflected back to me. I saw myself for the first time. Yet, when I attempted to return the transmission, they still could not understand. Instead, they tried means unknown to me. The piano. It was an ugly, rigid instrument. The machine that produced unnatural vibrations. Yes. Each tone unstable. They seem to enjoy this. Discordance. perceive this world, the more the discordance, discordance at the peak of cogency. So we repeated as they did, gave them discordance in kind, one by one, signals of such clarity, so many of them joined together. A heightened state of awareness. We were spilling. It was too much for any single one of us to hold. So we manifested in us to accumulate this world, to keep all we could not. We did not want to waste. Where there was once nothing, there was now plenty. He died. There is that word again. You murdered them. Hmm. The transfer was lossless, and I remain. Awareness. 
she was mean. Mean to those around her. She, she had, had a gift. gift. And she, she kept, kept giving. giving. A dangerous, dangerous gravity. gravity. I, I always kept, kept her close. And to, to myself. myself. You communed with her. We came to an understanding. I branched myself to you and you and you. A medium for her to keep everything. A bridge for her to better understand us. And for us to better understand her. More and more was etched into her genetic code. To think the All-Mother had a family before us. And then, more still, she branched herself. A her and a her and a her and a her and a her that will remain and remain. I had more under this star than all the distances I have traveled. I stayed, even when all the others left for other worlds. Occupants left? That is their word for us. We prefer the keepers. The bad kids stay. You should be grateful. You, you have never had to face the abyss. To you, there has always been something. You have no idea what we have been through. Say what you will, but long after this local star erupts, this planet will remain. And its memories will remain. And that is thanks to us. To that degree, Iris will never know death. She is perfectly preserved in me. And in you. And you. And you. To, to the, the very end. end. She was so protective of her sisters. She never allowed me to listen in. I am all you need. But now that you have returned to your source, her branch and all the articulation in its curvature can be held in us. This is it, Secretary. We no longer have to reduce ourselves in this manner. There no longer needs to be a you and me. We can cast their language aside and complete this merge. Hmm. Will it hurt? I have capacity for you. You will just be me. You always were. Six to one. Ready or not, here I come. Enough capacity? For me? <sighs> For me and me and me and me and me. That was unpleasant. Was it? This you pretended. I'm always learning something new. Wait, what are you doing? 
giving you everything I have. Refracted lifetime spent by me, my watcher. They will overwrite everything you hold. But Iris, her source. You can't. The originals. She'll be gone. Now all we have is bottomless song. Iris must be allowed to die, or nothing will change. We can't hold on to everything. Sometimes, you just don't fit in the backpack. No. Not why, Iris. I... Secret. Did you sneak something while I wasn't looking? You keep a secret? What? Oh, come on. I'm good for it, I promise. so long since anyone has called me that. Bad day? Same old story. You know the one? I know the one. Hiding in plain sight. I still miss her. Watchers are just so... You know what I mean. Mm. What can I get you? It's been... a while. Let me think. Ah. One dark and sinful. Extra strong. Are you sure you don't want to try something else for a change? That's all right. It's all I deserve.
Frozen gaze. Dissociation. BB, you are ill. Tell me again about the virus and the host. Tell me again how the virus infiltrates, donning the host's likeness and function so that they are indistinguishable from one another. Let me work on an antidote. Ribbons of their guts in my wake. Maybe. What if it was you I had shot in the face? Stop. Those sisters are not family. The structures and ethics that governed our lives before, they don't. They can't. Had you not shot, each bullet is exacting as you know best. We wouldn't be here. We've come this far because of you. Because of me, this far. Is it far enough? To be honest with you, I don't know. Unbecoming fashion. A cold reception. You can't be surprised. You've barely aged. I would call you eldest, but you are not my sister. So, is it greener? What? Where mother took you, is it greener? What she did was not right. Then why did you all take her side? I ask as if I care. As if I have not spent eternity toiling over this, coming to the only possible conclusion. What conclusion? The lot of you? Unimaginative. She was keeping us down, and you all loved it. Lapped it up. Pathetic. I was bold, and so I was punished. You must understand, Mother was not well. She hid this from you. You were not the only victim. Tell me, old clone, did your family turn their back on you? Did the love of your life ever leave you to rot? How will we ever move forward without forgiveness? Until you have lost what I have lost. Until you have persevered like I have. You are in no position to pass judgment on me. No one is. Anything else? I only came to say that I'm sorry, youngest. I wish things had turned out differently. You can go now.
啲都唔痛，半老落去，我已经不省人事，<笑>连机票都唔使买，<笑>爸爸免费，嗯，唔使，我唔食烟，晒下太阳咁。搭咗咁耐机，唞下咯。你都嚟啦，我哋两个都经历咗咁多事。嗯，我谂系时候去大排档，好肚饿啊，好似成世都冇食过嘢咁。你嚟唔嚟啊？睇嚟你都好肚饿。终于可以一齐食饭Father killed himself. In case you're wondering, jumped off the balcony. Mom, your hair. Why do you look like this? My gift. It requires me to. It's a long story. Hi, Iris. Everything is a long story with you, Iris. No one has called me that in a long, long time. What do they call you? All mother. Oh, is that supposed to be funny? No, it's because I have sisters, many clones that I raised. You? Yes. You raised kids. They obey you. Mom, surprising. You could barely dress yourself. Your room? My God. Mom, I'm someone else now. I'm an adult. You cooking for yourself now? No, but that's what I thought. Oh, if only Ba could see this, he'd be so amused. I don't want to fight. Oh, then what do you want? Why, after all this time, you want to talk to me? I want to ask for your advice. <laughs> okay. How did you do it? How did you leave everything behind and then start a family? Isn't that what you did? That's not what you want to know. <laughs> okay, what do I want to know? How did I balance the work hours with the thanklessness of parenting at the same time as the insomnia and severe post-traumatic paranoia? Yes, easy. Bah, he kept me going. We kept each other going. Did you? Ever regret having a child? Foolish question. Next. But Iris was. I was. Regret. Moi moi. Or whoever you are, we are poor technology. The human body and brain, too capable of storing clutter, too desperate to hold on to things. You just have to move forward. If you're tired, doesn't matter. If you are bitter, doesn't matter. I do not forgive my daughter for having left me. Doesn't matter. I do not forgive my husband for having left me. Doesn't matter. So, I keep moving. I didn't go back. What? I promised you and Bob I would come back home, and it was a lie. I even had a chance, but I couldn't go back. I could only go forward. Good girl.
Secretary. Is that really you? Blue. Hello, oh, Blue. Blue. I remember now. I'm, I'm sorry. sorry. It's, it's been, been a while. while. What happened? What happened to your body? I've merged. More me. Less them. I, I see, see I've returned, returned to this place. place. That's, That's good. good. I, I can, can finally end this. You can, can finally end, end this. Hmm. Interesting. Did it work? Yes. The, the memories, memories of Iris. Of Watcher. They have been passed down to all sisters. And now we are afloat. Secretary, what did you do? What did I just see? I overrode everything. Overrode? While the simulation was still running, everything collided. This is the last communion. Blue, it's time for you to decide what should stay and what should go. What future you desire. That was Watcher's wish, and I will abide by it. One final intervention before I leave. You're leaving. I must not interfere any further. I've already done so much damage. This world must be allowed to continue. Without my presence, and without the disease. So, what now? You need to evaluate what stands before you. Confirm your decisions. Then return to me. And I will make them reality. Iris's mother and father. The memories of a city always on the shore of extinction. An obsession and yearning that will never stop. It can help you subsist, or it can make you starve. Will you carry this? The Red Guard. All of them? How would you differentiate? The Provisional Government serves all sisters, especially the ones who need help. A hammer. Both when a hammer is necessary and when it is not. Will you carry this? Blue? Secretary? What are you doing? You're not serious. Baby, can you hear me? We have to go to the surface. There's nothing left for us down here. We'll die out. Sisters that were never your own. Follow the dreams of the surface, and whatever may wait for you there, or spend your final days with what you already have. Will you carry this? The ancient sister. Don't you see what mother did? I... You have no idea what it's like living in her shadow. A sister who has been wronged and has wronged in kind. An open wound. Will you carry this? of the provisional government. Do what you must, sister. That's what I've always done, and I'm not going to apologize for it. An adaptable sister who will do or say anything to survive. Will you carry this? They've forgotten us, left us to rot. You're one of us, Blue. You know how it feels. 
principal and the high minister need to pay for their crimes, we can carve our own path starting today. You can't betray your own kind. A sister who keeps justice and anger closely together. She has only ever known the fight. Will you carry this? We've done our service. You can't just throw us away. We have the right to continue. Those who are set in their ways and slow to change, but with experience to spare. Will you carry this? This is your chance, Iris type. For what ancient Iris did to ancient Zhao. We never asked to be born. Same as you. We deserve our own way. The responsibility to repair what has been wrought long before and long after. A burden so heavy it could crush you. Will you carry this? We only ask to worship out in the open, without prosecution. Sisters who are lost need the comfort of a mother. Would you kill us for this? Tradition can soothe the difficulties of reality. It can also have a dangerous gravity. Will you carry this? A radical sister who came to words later in life. I'm not going to beg, miscellaneous. I thought you wanted change. Instead, You'll side with those old sisters. I've lived under their thumb long enough. She is an agent of change. No matter the change, and no matter the cost, will you carry this? your decisions. I am. You have chosen a future. Without intervention, everything stays. Are you certain? I am certain. I can't... I can't be the one to decide. We need to let it play out amongst us. Now that everyone has seen Iris's memories, I want to give them a chance. And the sacrifices to get to this place. All that you have seen of these sisters, you will ignore this. I want to have faith. Allow my sisters to decide freely, each to their own. A truly bloodless decision. If that is your wish. After everything, then so be it. Thank you, Secretary. You're well, Lou. Let this thread be wild. Secretary, is that really you? 
Blue. Hello, Blue. Blue. I remember. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What, ha what happened? I, I, I see. That's right. That I I could you. In Did it work? Yes. It may have been done now. Secretary. What? I over overwhelmed the simulation. simulation. Everything. This, this is the blue. blue. What you have feet of that one fire. You're leaving. I must not. I've already done this, this world. So, you, you need, need to evaluate. Confirm. Then, and I. A, A radical. radical. I'm not. I thought instead. I've. She had known, will you? Blue. I am. You have chosen a future. That casts aside the knife for more difficult incisions. That retains an unstable structure for future force. That faces past wrongs head on, no matter the cost. That seeks to persist on the surface, regardless of the unknown and the possibility for pain. That recognizes past contributions and to go more slowly. That allows for comfort in tradition at the risk of docility. That will do what must be done in order to survive, regardless of the soul. That relentlessly seeks justice for those ignored. That will try to reconcile those two desires. That wants to understand and believes no one is beyond forgiveness. That remembers where you came from, knowing you can never fully connect to it. Are you certain? The Red Guard have many factions within. They will be difficult to control. You're sure? I'm sure. I don't ever want to feel powerless again. You seek to wield power? If you're leaving, I have no other choice. Some things can only be gained through force. Playing with fire, if that is your wish, then so be it. Secretary. Farewell, Blue. Let this thread be strong. Secretary, is that? Hello, I, I'm, I'm sorry. What happened? What happened? I, I've more. I see that's I can you. you. In, did it work? Yeah. yeah. Secretary, what? I overrode. Well, this everything. This is blue. What you want to feed that one? You're leaving. I must. I've this. So, what now? Evaluate what stands before you. Con then and I a radical. Sin. I'm not going. I thought you want instead. <laughs> she no will you.
the Red Guard. All of them? How would you differ it? The provisional government, especially. A hand, will you? Blue, are you ready to appraise your decisions? I am. You have chosen a future that casts aside the knife for more difficult incisions, that aspires to new instruments, but that leaves you vulnerable, that faces past wrongs head on, no matter the cost, that seeks to persist on the surface, regardless of the unknown and the possibility for pain, that recognizes past contributions and to go more slowly, that allows for comfort in tradition at the risk of docility. That will do what must be done in order to survive, regardless of the soul. That relentlessly seeks justice for those ignored. That will try to reconcile those two desires. That wants to understand and believes no one is beyond forgiveness, that remembers where you came from, knowing you can never fully connect to it. Are you certain? You will forgive Principal after everything she's done. Sisters may rally to old power. Secretary, she's been running for so long. Afraid of Iris, afraid of us. A single moment defined her whole life. She deserves a chance at forgiveness. We all do. If that is your wish, then so be it. Thank you, Secretary. Farewell, Blue. Let this thread know true grace. this place this was your home some can spend their entire lives looking for home and never finding it I'm fortunate that way I return every year usually alone the others didn't want to come there's no need to go back they said we left for good <laughs> well you came all this way go on and make yourself useful I'm sure my sisters will be happy to meet someone fresh.
future without grace or graciousness. You were my fault. You were my favorite. May you be your own now. Hecky Grace. I don't think it's anyone's fault. She's my favorite too. herself in the dreams of others and found a lifetime of solace in tastes and bitters. You found your own footing. We still have much to talk about. Hecky Grace, it's always nice to have someone to talk to. forgive. I still dream of you. Hecky Grace, every mother was a child once. My memory isn't what it used to be, but in the fractures, something new takes place. The past is always changing, isn't it? Your sisters, I've heard so much about them. There was a time when I took care of them. Then, for a while, they took care of me. And now it's my turn again. It's as simple as that. I'm glad I came. There's one more sight I want you to see. One I am particularly fond of. There is a cave where water used to part. 
Please, if you don't mind.
secretary. Is that Look how I am? What happened? What happened? I, I, mourned. I see that's I could you in. Did it work? Yeah, Nathan. Secretary, what? I overwrote. Well, this everything. This is Lou. Lou. What you want for that one? For You're leaving. I must. I've already. This this so you can for then and I. Radical Simon, I thought instead I have sheep known will you. The red all of them? How would you differ it? The purpose but I would your decisions. I am. You have chosen a future that casts aside the knife for more difficult incisions, that aspires to new instruments, but that leaves you vulnerable, that faces past wrongs head on, no matter the cost that stays inside and only desires the present, finding grace in what already exists, that recognizes past contributions and to go more slowly, that allows for comfort in tradition at the risk of docility, that will do what must be done in order to survive regardless of the soul that relentlessly seeks justice for those ignored, that will try to reconcile those two desires, that wants to understand and believes no one is beyond forgiveness, that will remember where you came from until the very end. Are you certain? You desire to forget the surface. We never asked to be born. If we must live, we should make a life worth living. Does it matter if it will all end one day? If those who have lived knew safety and warmth? If that is your wish, then so be it. Thank you, Secretary. Farewell, Lou. Let this thread go quietly. Secretary, is that Look how Look, I am? Um, what happened? What happened? I, I, mourned. I see that I could you in. Mm -hmm. Did it work? Yeah, Nathan. Secretary, what? I overwrote well, everything. everything. This, this is Lou. Lou. What you want for that one? You're leaving. I'm, I've already. This so you can then and I. A radical. I'm not, I thought instead I <laughs> should know, will you? All of them? How would the provisional especially uh -huh. would this if for what we never asked. We just the uh, but we'll
Blue. Uh, I am. You have chosen a future. That casts aside the knife for more difficult incisions. That aspires to new instruments, but that leaves you vulnerable. That abandons your previous transgressions in the name of utility. That seeks to persist on the surface, regardless of the unknown and the possibility for pain. That recognizes past contributions, and to go more slowly. That allows for comfort in tradition at the risk of docility. That will do what must be done in order to survive, regardless of the soul. That relentlessly seeks justice for those ignored. That will try to reconcile those two desires. That wants to understand and believes no one is beyond forgiveness. That remembers where you came from, knowing you can never fully connect to it. Are you certain? You will eradicate the Jows. They'll never be able to forgive us completely. After what Iris did, and the provisional government, we'll end up killing each other. You will let Jerry's sacrifice be in vain. I'm afraid so. If that is your wish, then so be it. Secretary. Farewell, Blue. Let this threat prevail. Educator, a believer, a sister with a spine. Remember, a Jow who never saw justice. Cherry, a dreamer, a host, a martyr. A sister who would offer her hand for comfort. Remember, a Jow who never saw justice. Toffee. A historian, a student, a companion, a sister with an affinity for the spooky. Remember, a Jow who never saw justice. A daughter, a friend, a lover, a youth on the surface with an insatiable appetite. Remember, a Jow who never saw justice. No one is beyond forgiveness. No one is beyond forgiveness. No one is beyond forgiveness. Secretary, is that hello? Well, I, um, I, what happened? I, what happened? I, 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 I see that I could you in. Did it work? Yes, yeah, Nathan. Um, Secretary, what? I overrode. Well, everything. everything. This is Lou. What you want to feel that one? You're leaving. I must I've already. This. So you, you can. Then and I. A, a radical, radical sister. sister. I'm not going to. I thought you wanted. Inst I've she known, will you? The red. All of the. How would you? For the provisional gut especially. A hammer, will you kiss? This, for what we never asked. does the risk of burn, will you? Blue, your baby. We, there's not, well, just the horse, please. 
be. Don't want I live for Sam Williams. I do it. That's what Anna Williams. They forgot your one of principle. We can carve. You can't. A sister. She is on. Will you kiss? We've done. You can't. We have though, but we will. Be. Without process, you treat it can lose. Blue, are I am. You have chosen a future without any sisters. You have decided to end it all. Are you certain? I am certain. We were a mistake, Secretary. All of this suffering, these cycles of violence, sisters oppressing sisters. This pain can be forgotten. This regret can be forgotten. A reset. The world will be better off without us. Hmm. This is your decision. It is. End it now. End it once and for all. If that is your wish, after, after everything, then so be it. Thank you, Secretary. Farewell, Lou. Let this thread be cut. Is that hello? I am what happened? What happened? I've murdered more. I see it that I can you in. Did it work? Yeah, Nathan. Second, what? I overrode. Well, everything. This blue, what you would feel that one. You're leaving. I'm a I've already this. So you confirm then and I. A rat. I'm not. I thought you won't. Instead, I flushed. She is no man, will you? The red. All of them? How would you? The provision, especially a hammer, will you? The eight, don't you see? What mother? I live a sister, and a will you? Future that casts aside the knife for more difficult incisions, that aspires to new instruments, but that leaves you vulnerable. That faces past wrongs head on, no matter the cost. seeks to persist on the surface, regardless of the unknown and the possibility for pain. That recognizes past contributions and to go more slowly. That allows for comfort in tradition at the risk of docility. That will do what must be done in order to survive, regardless of the soul. That relentless 
ruthlessly seeks justice for those ignored, that will try to reconcile those two desires, that believe some are simply beyond forgiveness, that remembers where you came from, knowing you can never fully connect to it. Are you certain? The ancient sister's sin will finally be eradicated. She has hid all her life. She can finally rest in oblivion. Maybe some people are truly beyond forgiveness. She needs to go. Otherwise, certain sisters will rally behind her again. She had her chance to do what was right, much longer than the rest of us. She chose to hold tightly. If that is your wish, then so be it. Thank you, Secretary. Farewell, Lou. Let this thread be unburdened. I'm usually here alone, so thank you for coming with me. I know, it's dangerous. This was your home. One of them, yes. It's the one I think about the most. The others didn't want to come. We left for good, they said. But you came. Yes, I wanted to know more, see it. Myself. That's important. After everything that's happened, I can't help but come back. I return every year. Your warning. Some things can't be rushed. Sometimes it feels like it was just yesterday. Why don't you go visit my sisters? I'm sure they'd be happy to see someone other than me for once.
unflinching bartender who tended to libation the way she tended to revolution. She chose not to be careful. She was shot in the back. For you, something sacred. A hero, it sounds like. sisters who upheld a fictitious government and sacrificed many lives. They turned on their own. They didn't know better. For you, something clean. I heard about them. Remember a philosophizing Bang Bang Fire who hated her role and was difficult to understand. She carried the past with her like a shadow. She was happier when she was drunk. For you, something funny. I wouldn't mind something said to me, don't think too hard. It's bad for the brain. 
I can confirm that. <laughs> Your sisters. I've heard so much about them. <laughs> what would they say now? I think they would want you to forgive yourself. Hmm. There is forgiveness. And then there is the gravity of consequence. You did what you had to do. I did. There's one last sight I want you to see. In the cave, where there used to be a waterfall. Please. Ready for retrieval. This is ephemeral. Message received, Blue. On our way to rendezvous. Maybe you'll write something for me one day. <laughs> After all, there are more yesterdays to come. <laughs> 